Good morning, lads. Good morning, good morning, good morning. Lost, good morning, Rug, good morning. Alundra, good morning, SJ, McFluffy, Onionish, Blood. How are we doing? How are we doing, lads? How are we doing? I've had a morning. <laughs> but a bit of a, a bit of a morning. Hey, I would not even good morning. Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening. Sherwin, good morning. Good morning, good morning. Um, somebody, somebody, not pointing fingers, obviously. I wouldn't point a finger. Wouldn't, wouldn't dare point a finger. Oh dear, that, I didn't mean to click on that. <laughs> not that, don't look at the game yet. Um, somebody, peed on the rug. You know, I'm not gonna, I'm not pointing any fingers. I'm not pointing any fingers, but somebody. Oh. Have you decided to confess? Have you decided to confess your sins? Have you? Somebody peed on the peed on the rug. Um, no, she wasn't stressed. She was. She had a rather lovely morning. She um, she had her dentist stick, and I blame <laughs> everyone blaming everyone else except the actual culprit, eh? The actual culprit. Hmm? Big baby. Yeah, big baby. Um, she had a dentist stick, and uh, she she ran away. And, um, you know, I'll, I'll talk about my finger in a minute. Um, and then I thought, I'm not going to, I'm not going to follow her because usually what she does is she just, she goes and she whines until, um, until like she gets to go on a walk. She, she that's, that's what, you know, she does that. Um, and I'm like, I'm not, you know, I'm not going to follow her. I'm not going to follow her. I'm going to just let her whine it out. Um, she didn't whine, by the way. She just ran away. And then I hear... <laughs> That's the noise I hear quietly. That's the w one noise I hear, and I'm like, right. So I get up, but by the time I've gotten up, she's run back to me. Um, and I'm like, oh, okay, right. You were just okay. All right, fine. Yeah, like a Minecraft villager noise, exactly. I was like, all right, fine, cool. You know, you, you were clearly just wanting to, you know, go out on a on your walk. So that's cool. Um. You know, let's just chill. Um, but I end up, I end up going in, going in to see the rug, and there's just a big puddle of piss, big fucking puddle of piss. She must have that wine must have come after the piss. She didn't ask to go out. She didn't ask. She didn't ask. She didn't bark. She usually, you know, so this is it's, it's bad because I, we don't want her to get in the habit. Of not asking to go pee. If she needs to pee, ask to go pee. Because she's usually pretty good with it. You know, she stands and she barks. Or she stands and she whines. And then we let her out to pee. Um, but all she made was a singular Minecraft villager noise. Presumably after she peed. Or during. Either in pleasure. <laughs> have to wait until they're allowed to piss. She doesn't have to wait though. She never has to wait. Because we know she doesn't wait. She, she doesn't, she doesn't wait. She doesn't. She, if she needs to pee, she needs to go. She needs to pee. So we don't get a choice. She doesn't, she, like, if she needs to pee, she gets to pee. Um, she's not, we never make her wait. We, I mean, we do make, you know, like, she, she does have to hold it sometimes. It's not, um, but, like, we know that she won't hold it, essentially. So, yeah, she's two and a half now. She's two and a half, so she is just she's still a bit of a baby. Did we scold her? So what we definitely try not to scold her because you're not supposed to scold them because then they can start submissively peeing. And you know what I'm saying? She has submissively peed before, we don't want that. Because we know she's predisposed to submissively peeing. Um so she just goes outside so she knows that when she pees, it's outside. Go outside. So yeah, so we we spent we spent just before stream cleaning up her. That's that. You know, she's a... Yeah. Wasn't happy because she hasn't done it for so long. And it's like, please don't. 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 No. <laughs> Not this again. <laughs> you know? Like, it's better that it's... The, I prefer it was the rug than the carpet. You know, like... Um, I prefer it was the rug than the carpet, I suppose. Um, so that's, that's good. It's, you know, easier to clean up. Um... Just wasn't just not overly happy that she did it. So, uh, yeah. yeah, yeah. 
and my finger. Um, so yesterday, you know, my um, my um, my thingy bob was um, my like my padding thing that I had taped on here was falling off. So I, I, you know, it 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 served its purpose, but we don't have anything, don't have anything left. Um, so all I had, we don't have like any bandages. So I was like, okay, how am I gonna stop me from bonking? Um, my finger. How am I gonna stop, like, stop myself from hitting it? How am I gonna, you know, s protect it essentially? Um, and so the Tony the Tiger sock has come into use, and uh, now I've got a bright blue sock around my finger. So please just ignore its presence. It is great. It has got Tony on it. His little face. It is still attached. It's doing a lot better actually. It's um, the swelling's gone down. Turning to the rescue, exactly. It's very, yeah, fashionable, right? You'd be seeing this in all the magazines. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, we have when we caught her in the act. We have scolded her before. Like, you know, <laughs> don't do it. But then, we caught her in the act once. And we were, <laughs> we were shouting, no, <laughs> stop. And she didn't stop. Do you know she didn't stop until we cupped her butt cheeks <laughs> <laughs> she was peeing and she she we were shouting at her to stop and you know scolding her she didn't stop so we had to get our hands under her butt cheeks and lift so obviously she was squatting and only at that point did she stop she's like what mum once it starts the flowing I ain't stopping Fucking rude. <laughs> yeah, kids today, I know, right? Fashion accessories of 2023. I'll be, I'll be named the most fashionable streamer. Mm -hmm. Rats pissing everywhere. Well, don't rats pee on their feet? And then run. Yeah. Buy a waterfall. <laughs> <laughs> May 6th coronation. Yeah, it's, um, what, we got a month? January, February, March, April, May. Yeah. And then we've got the day off on it on the eighth as well. I thought we were getting a double long weekend. I was a little bit disappointed. I thought we were getting two days off. We're only getting one day off. It's a shame. Will you guys be watching it? If we stay non, if we can stay non-political. <laughs> I'm asking. Are you guys gonna watch the coronation? I was thinking about having it on because it's you know it's like a historical event, right? Can I get pee on my bandages? No, the bandages were just falling off. They'd lost their, they'd lost their sticky, and they smell. They say it smelled so bad. It smelled like you know um, when you take a cast off. Um, so all I had, all, all I had was a sock. So we're using a sock because it, you know, protects the finger. Exactly, did you say exactly? <laughs> oh dear. Mmm. Will the cast of the crown be part of the coronation? So they've uh, they've struggled to get people actually to be part of the coronation, which obviously we're gonna topic topic we're gonna stay off of because it's political. Um, is it political? Yeah. Um, oh, we've got coronation plans. Coronation weekend plans announced. So there's the coronation service on Saturday the sixth. Uh, on the 7th, what do we got? Coronation concert. Am I invited? You know, I think I think my invite got lost in the ma mail. <laughs> Drunk. Bonjour. Bonjour. Can't watch Coronation. <laughs> watch a Coronation now. Rex, just throw some, throw some tea into the harbour while you're watching. It'll, it'll balance it out. You had front seats to the urination. Oh. There's a coronation big lunch. So it says coronation big lunch. Neighbors and communities across the United Kingdom are invited to share food and fun together at coronation big lunches on Sunday the 7th of May. Is any like in in a nationwide act celebration uh, of celebration and friendship from a cup of tea with a neighbor to a street party a, a coronation big lunch brings the celebrations to your neighborhood. Basically this is them telling you, oh, go have go have a cup of tea with your neighbor. It's not like they're providing the lunch. 
they're not pro they're not providing the lunch. Like I don't get like a, a lunch care package from fucking Chussy. Like they're like, oh, you've got to bring your own food though, and bring your own party, and set that all up yourself. Oh, they are organizing some of it. They are all gonna. All right, they are organizing some of it. Probably still have to bring your own food though. Um, what else we got? Let's have a duck dinner. You bring the ducks. <laughs> and have a neighbor. You bring the ducks, the dinner, the table, the chairs, the drinks. Jam and cream, yeah. <laughs> Just do it yourself, right? Is that how they name the street? Actually, I presume it is how they name the street, right? Yeah, so that, yeah, yeah, that's what's happening. I'll bring the napkins. Oh, will they be nice thick ones, like two-ply napkins? Yeah, you're welcome to celebrate if you organize and pay for it. <laughs> Great, thank you, Chissy. <laughs> Your generosity knows no bounds. Um, yeah, so that's happening on the coronation day. I'll probably I'll probably watch the watch the thing because it's like, you know, it's a. I like to watch these um, like historical events. So when when the queen died, I was I was there. I was watching. <laughs> Not like personally, not like through binoculars at a window, but I was I was watching because um, you know they started to hear the rumbling, so I tuned in, tuned into the the TV like the TV show that they had um, on about it. Two ply, what are we millionaires or oh, the one ply napkin? <laughs> oh dear, yeah. So uh, I might watch it because you know I just I don't I don't know. What's on the side of the screen? What this? Which side of the screen? This one. What? This, that, that. Oh! What's this? See my little pink head? Yeah. Just the hinge. I should really cover this hinge up, to be honest. It is a little bit of a... A little bit of a distraction. Like, it comes up more than you'd think it was. It would. Yeah. That's it. That's it. You, yeah, it comes up more than I you think it would. I should maybe like put a, a tiny picture of Betty White just here. Sock finger looks weird. I know it looks weird. I it feels weird as well because there's like this big I know it looks weird. It's purpose rather than um what's the word? Purpose uh pu 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 purpose I, d I don't know where I don't the, the, the line of thought has been severed. I'm always looking at my eyebrows. Oh yeah. Function over fashion. That's the one. That's the one. <laughs> Should see the latest Nike winter fashion. But it's not winter anymore. The sock on your finger reminded me. Oh no. See, maybe I'm ahead of the times. Hey, T can. How you doing? Oh, it doesn't look too bad. I guess probably Google isn't the best. I gotta keep that finger attached somehow. Yeah, this is my gaming finger. I gotta take care of it, lads. You know, I've um, I'm a little bit worried about it. Let me share share a worry with you. Um, I can't. <laughs> I've lost a little bit of feeling in it. Lost a little bit of a, a little bit of. I've got a little bit of numbness, uh, so I'm I'm a tad bit concerned that um, <laughs> yeah. Obviously, I'm hoping it's gonna come back um, after it's uh, after it's healed. But I'm a little bit <laughs> worried, a little bit worried about my gaming figure. <laughs> King Charles will make it all better. He'll give the the, the coronation day on coronation day. It'll just it'll matter. It's like Jesus, you know. It will be magically healed. Um, don't cut off circulation. Oh no, it's not. It's not cut off. It's got um, worse circulation than the rest of them. It's still. It can still breathe. Don't worry, he's doing okay. Is that my main poking finger? Yeah, it's my smell your mum finger. You like the Nike Air Max nineties? Thank you for the chat. Love. I am. Um, I'm not a bit. I'm not big into sneakers or, or trainers. I've got one pair that I like. You know that I, I wear. 
Yeah, it's arena day. So I did think about swapping it around. I did think about playing cars, honestly. But I, I just, I just, <laughs> just wanted to play arena. Over, pronation. What's what is that ship wind? What like um orthopedic ones? I had some orthopedic ones. They were quite nice. Yeah, I did think about playing cars because I do kind of want to finish cars. Um, but I'm gonna keep it, you know, keep it for a special, uh, special occasion. Never, Tekken. Never. Honestly, never. Have I considered Dredge? So Dredge looked a little bit. So I have, I have considered it. I, I I've been asked about Dredge a few times actually. Um, not on stream. Just I've had some friends ask me about Dredge too. Um, I don't. Know, it looks a little bit sad. <laughs> See, it's sad the right way wait right right way of saying it um it looks it may, yeah a little bit scary a little bit kind of um dark maybe is that grungy is the word i'd use but not in a like i feel like people think it's a bad thing when i say grungy it's not a bad thing it's like grungy is a feeling not necessarily an opinion makes sense yeah it looks a little bit grungy um not that I'm gonna say never, we never play dredge, but it might be it might be a little bit grungy for me at the moment. I don't like too much grung all at once, you know. Oh, it's when your foot bends slightly inward when you're walking and running. Oh, so you've gotta have pretty good arch support for that one. I should imagine to like push it push it outwards. A new game that can attract more people? No. <laughs> nice it's fishing, isn't it? I don't I the fishing looks okay in it. Hey look, we just got finished with a new game! <laughs> got finished with a new game and we're gonna be playing Jedi Survivor next week. Is that when it comes out? Next Friday I think it comes out, so that's a new game. <laughs> yeah, it just it looks a little bit grungy. A little bit scary, a little bit um kind of it's gonna make me feel sad, you know? <laughs> it's gonna make me feel sad after I finish playing it. I can't run too many grungy games at once because otherwise I feel like, cause Sherlock, Sherlock left me feeling a little bit sad, you know? Cause it deals with, uh, deals with sad, um, like sad topics, I guess. You know, murder isn't exactly happy, right? Um, so if I run too many, I find myself myself feeling sad <laughs> like um uh, i remember during october during spooktober i ended up feeling quite like um quite sad because we were running senua 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 which left me fit i felt very sad after that one um and then what else do we play village which is you know not exactly the happiest of games um and what else did we run Remember the other horror game? It must have been a retro one. What kind of game would I like to play? Oh, one with Todd Howhard in it. <laughs> I don't know. Um, I've I've had yeah, I've had a little bit of um, a little bit of trouble trying to figure out what games I want to play at the moment. Um, so I did consider playing Assassin's Creed. So again, it's got a little bit, more, bit. You know, I just I wasn't feeling it a lot. Was me and Greg were talking about it last night. I wasn't feeling it last night because it's you know got a little bit, but quite murdery. Um, <laughs> quite murdery, you know. Um, Nancy Drew. I'm quite in the mood for Nancy Drew. But I know not a lot of people like Nancy Drew, so I gotta spread them out. <laughs> I gotta give myself a treat of Nancy Drew every so often. Because <laughs> Nancy Drew is quite nice because it never. You know, it's not that sad. You know, Nancy Drew is meant for younger, younger audiences. Um, so it's not too sad, if that makes sense. Like Merchant of Venice, that was like thieving. No one got, no, no one got murdered there. Great. Hey, Urban. Good morning. Good morning. <laughs> sad. Yeah, well, Sherlock is a little bit sad himself, so it, you know, it kind of imparts a bit of sadness onto me and the dead people, you know, a little bit sad as well. Yeah, I love Nancy Drew. Nancy Drew is definitely a cult classic. It is a cult classic. 
I think uh, Nice Juice also got quite a good idea. Um, what's it? Merch store. Hey, Pop Talk, good morning. Played all 33. Is she looking forward to, um, she's looking forward to the new one that comes out. But yeah, so I got, I got to, I got to balance the grung, essentially is what I'm saying. I got to balance the grung with the, with the non-grung, because otherwise I end up feeling the grung in myself. Um, <laughs> no one wants to feel the, no one wants to feel the grung. Hang on, move my coffee before I drop it. Right, you're ready, Rug. You're ready. It smells sweet. It smells sweet, just like you. Is this Daggerfall? This is earlier than Daggerfall. This is Arena. This is this is the before times. Before before Daggerfall was even even a little idea in Todd Howard's mind. Um. Oh my goodness! You will win the lottery soon. Oh, it's for popped up. Well, Pop Tart, you will win the lottery very soon. That's a good one. That's like one of the top ones. I want to know what this game is about. You know, I'll get, I'll get to it. I'll get to it. I'll get to it. You will win the lottery very soon. You know, they don't say whether it's five pounds, ten pounds, a uh, hundred pounds. They don't say. The very early cases where you go on to smell of fish <laughs> I mean what was I saying it was a good thing or a bad thing Rooks on your billions and millions I mean this would make me do the lottery because you may as well right how much does the lottery cost now <laughs> I remember you will win I'm rich <laughs> Yeah, would you, uh, like, that, yeah, that would make me go, that would make me go do the lottery. Oh, my God. So, see, this is my problem, is I, did I, do you think I, think I saved? Todd gets a quest, Todd escapes, Todd murders a gobbo, Todd makes profit, Todd levels up, Todd gets it, ow? Todd gets it up, I presume I was supposed to be saying. Todd leaves the dungeon, Todd needs the riz, Todd goes to rehab, and Todd discovers romance. Do you think these are in order of saves, or do you think good for Todd getting it up? <laughs> Todd gets a quest, maybe. Yeah, maybe. Look, yeah, you know what? Maybe it's the first one. Oh my god! Okay. Oh, hello, sir. Who are you? Hello, I'm Flazen, but then again, ultimately, aren't we all? What can I do for you? Hello, Flazen. Aren't we all Flazen? Are you guys Flazen? Um, I don't actually, I don't need to know where is something. We are an <laughs> all, in fact, Flazen. I knew it. You got any rumors, Flazen? General rumors will do me. Nothing much is going on as far as I know. No, his name isn't Flaccid, is it? <laughs> Imagine carry you carry a baby for nine months and you call it Flaccid. Right, we... Uh, I need to remember the controls. <laughs> I was gonna... We. I know where we're going. We are heading to, uh, I've forgotten all of the buttons. We are heading to the Gobbo's Lair. Oh yeah. Arrow keys are right, thank you. Right, is it map? M for map? I can't remember how to do the zoomed out map. Is it right click? Right click and left click do different things. I think we're here right now. Uh, we want to go to rehab, but I said no, no, no. Here I come back. Hang on, isn't it, isn't Rooks here? Rooks, are you not supposed to be at work today? Trash overloaded. Thank you so much for the raid. Oh my goodness, thank you very much. Welcome in. Welcome in, raiders. How was marbles? Who won the Who won the marbles? 
who won the marble run. Welcome in, Raiders. I'm Captain Badgertail. We are playing um, the original Elder Scrolls. There is the OG. Um, we are playing as Todd Howhard. Todd Howhard. Um, affiliation to persons living or dead is merely coincidental. Um, we are a, a wizard thief. Both a wizard and a thief, which is, you know, really appropriate. Um, and the beautiful, beautiful queen has just sent us on a quest to clear out a gobbo cave. It just works. Exactly. It just works. Hey, trash overloaded. Red message didn't copy. <laughs> welcome in. How was the stream, though? How was the stream? And Transmeta, welcome in. Priapus! Thank you very much for the follow. Welcome in. Welcome in. We play Tilted and I just kill people. <laughs> we crush their marbles. <laughs> oh, right. I'm walking out of work right now. I, yeah, I'm checking up on you. Yeah. Make sure you didn't take that fake sick day. I'm sure Rehad was down here, was it not? Right now we're stuck on the map because I need to find whether... I'm sure Rehad was bottom right. It's not. Go back. We're not Hammerfell. Oh, we're in Hammerfell, obviously. Too honest to take a fake sick day. I remember my um my maths teacher at high school said, if you ever want to take a fake sick day, make your call to your manager be the first thing that comes out of your mouth because you sound the worst when you first wake up because you've still got your like sleepy voice. So call them straight away when you wake up before your voice has time to sound better. It just sounds sicker. <laughs> Murders us and for some reason we keep joining. <laughs> it's like the fucking Hunger Games. <laughs> do I not want to get a stone keep? Yeah, right, I do. Let's go. And a school for scoundrels. My maths teacher was very nice. Thank you very much. She was not a scoundrel. A cracked sign shrouded in dust reads, Welcome to Stonekeep. Surrender all weapons. Well, I didn't read that. <laughs> Hope it wasn't anything fucking important. Yeah, there we go. We got diseased last time. Yeah, we got brain, brain something. Uh, weapons to the guards, for we are the keepers of peace. Well, let's send them home in pieces. So this place is infested with gobbos. And as far as I remember, oh, we've got to get rid of the gobbos. And there's some kind of treasure here as well. Brain fever is what we got last time. And is it C to check my... My vitals? I don't remember what button it is to check. Oh. Another rat. Hey, Van Buren. Good morning. Oh. Can I go through here? This looks like a door. Hi, Stinky. Because ideally, we don't want to get sick again. Hey, computer machine. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Ooh, look at all this loot. 88 gold pieces. See, I don't see why I would bother. So I get I get some quests um, suggested to me. Oh, yeah, we look we look very sexy, by the way. Uh, Todd is a leather daddy. Um, we get some quests given to us in pubs and stuff. But we earn more money from just kind of wand wandering around and finding piles of stuff. I don't know whether I would ever, why I would ever take... There's mo the it's red, I can't use it. There's no point in me putting it in my hands. Did that rat just open a door? I heard a door open. Alright, left door, right door. Maybe I should save? can't remember the button for saving. <laughs> uh, 
Why is it not escape? Oh, there it is! It is escape, alright. It's been a week since we've played this, so, you know, kind to me. I don't remember all the buttons. Todd. Todd, Todd kills rats with two, two, two S's. How hard is Todd how hard? That's what he wants you to ask. The secret. Family secret. Numbering the saves with <laughs> Yeah, but then it's not nearly as funny when <laughs> her future badger doesn't know what she's doing. Well, this looks promising, right? The sconces. I take that dagger. I like these, I like these weird electric sconces. Rock metal tot. <laughs> I think we got a map of the area as well. Okay, here we are. Not the best map in the world, but it's better than- No! Ah, more gobbos! No, oh, that's a lot of fucking goblins! Oh my god, mowing them down. That was like, that was a, did you see that? That was a d -d -d double kill. Goblin's got nothing usable. What about this one? They bleed on the rug. Incidentally, not the worst thing I've had done to a rug today. <laughs> Never could get out of the sewer. I just had to just keep on, just, you had to keep on trucking. Just keep on heading forwards, and eventually I made it out of the sewer. The map was mildly helpful in the sewer as well. Oh, more gobos, more gobos! Oh. Right, we might have to do a spell. Not a fire spell. Please heal yourself. You. Hey, good morning, Mr. West. Enjoying it, yeah. I think I'm enjoying it a lot more than I expected to. It's. It's both what I. Like, I both didn't expect it to be like this, and it's kind of what I expected it to be. It's a lot easier than I was. Uh, than I thought it was gonna be. If that. Not to be like, oh, I find games so easy. But I think I'd heard that it was going to be a real fucking struggle bus. Like what we're supposed to be going. But it isn't too bad. You know, I feel like it's it's a... It's not too much the bus of struggle. Just, just, you know, I'm just such a pro gamer. So easy. Maybe this wasn't where I was meant to be going. Yeah, to get all the pieces. Yeah, because we've got to we've got to get the. Oh dear, I haven't got my. Blood. Get get your sword out, Todd. Get Todd, how hard hasn't even got his bloody sword out? I think the main thing I have problems with is the um the frames. Maybe. Hey, signing Sam. I'm doing good, thank you. I hope you're having a lovely Tuesday as well. It's a little, like, it's a little bit laggy, you know? Could speed it back up, but then it's too fast. Then the goblins also get faster too, Greg. And then the, the, the riding's too fast as well. Yes, chop, choppity, chippity, chop. I don't mind. I don't mind too much the swinging of the weapon. I think it would be um, if you hover the detail bar. Much of a difference. Is this the detail bar? Oh, lower the detail bar. Oh. Yeah, I think I've got mine turned all the way up. But I want you know. I gotta see. I gotta see arena in all of its beautiful details. You know. I don't want to be missing in, missing out on this truly beautiful game. Should I mow the lawn? It needs to on this cold, wet, and possibly snowy day. Absolutely not, right? I mean, the bull says yes, but I say no. 
Who are you going to listen to? Happen. I say no, because if it's going to rain, you're just going to end up chewing up chewing up your bloody garden. Is S status. I can't remember. Oh, there we go. Uh, I'm healthy. Lovely. I wanted to check I didn't have any brain issues. Look at the realistic lighting, I know. I still stand by the fact that I think that this game would work well on the Wii. <laughs> I think Nintendo should bring this game posthumously to the Wii. I think the controls really lend themselves to motion controls. Or, you know, VR it would be good and even. Ooh. Some life-giving water. I also kind of wish that you could interact with more things. Oh, 3DS. You could use the... The 3DS had motion controls as well, right? Right, we're back... Back here. Ah! Jesus Christ! <laughs> Please kill him. Come on, Todd. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Slowly pivoting around and seeing that fucking wolf there to get the shit out of me. Jesus. Right. Um, Todd kills rats. Todd murders a gobbo. Where there is one wolf, there's more. Oh, dear. You're probably this way, right? If I was a wolf, I'd be over here. I see him. Oh no. I kind of like, I like. Oh, I can camp into food. There are enemies nearby. Oh. Oh, uh, there's a man! Why is there a man? <laughs> Who is this man? Oh, kill him! Kill him, Todd! With you died our last hope for justice. <laughs> making him this Sorry fucking woman making me feel guilty will. for dying. She's it so rude. Me to see the beautiful land of Camriel rotting from within. Goodbye. I wish you peace in the afterworld. I feel like she doesn't wish me peace. She's like, oh, now you're dead. You know, like, clearly dying was your fault. She's so rude. Right. Todd murders a wolf. Maybe we should, uh... I do want to camp somewhere. I don't know where though. Maybe like round here, around this corner. Probably shouldn't do it, just there's enemies nearby. This is like so. Why well, I killed it. I don't know where it is, but I killed it. Oh, it's around the corner. It was an amazing death scene. First meeting isn't for 45 minutes. All right, I'll message your manager not to worry for 45 minutes then. Oh, you're virtuous. Well, your manager hasn't been saying that to me. You know, we've got a group chat. Right, let's try camping here. Goodness sake, why there's so many enemies? Leave me alone! Todd, pivot, 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 pivot. I don't... Oh, it's... God's sake, these men! With you. Oh. Where do these men keep coming from? Alright. It's raining men. He is. Let me just... just... All right, I had enough of uh, one more heal. You're saying that someone's birthing these men. Like the... Don't like that noise. I'm here. I 
I don't like this noise. What, what is this noise? Oh, we haven't been through here, I don't think. The lock looks to be all beyond your skills. Sag. Why, well, I can hear something I don't want to say hello to behind that door. I've been, um, I've been thinking, talking about Telltale. I've been thinking about playing the Telltale Monkey Island games. Try to pick it anyway. There's clearly a line behind that door, though. I don't know how to pick it. This? Select target for pilfering. Oh my god, it worked! There is a lad! He's not got trousers on! With you died our last hope for justice. That was a big lad. That was a big lad without trousers on. Why didn't he have trousers on? He had like a kind of, I guess, a swimsuit. A metal swimsuit. Like his crotch was covered. Try hard on top. Todd, Todd, I thought you would be better than this, Todd. We'll try again. And so uh, let's go after the orc again. Fully rendered thighs. Oh, do you think you do you think it was maybe like a show of strength? He wants everyone to see his beautiful, th strong thighs. Todd, how floppy. Like the Monkey Island games. A lot of the games, the chapter and cha chapter to chapter quality varies. <laughs> Sometimes the I couldn't get past that corner. Sometimes the worst chapters are the best chapters, though. They were flesh-colored trousers, or were they see-through trousers? Like a see-through kind of plastic, like a jelly shoe, but for your legs, jelly legs. Failure. Can I just keep keep doing it? Failure. Can I I think maybe I can just keep failure. God, how did I do it first time last time? Failure. You can hit the door too. Ooh. Right, Todd. Go, Todd, go. Go, Todd, go. Keep stabbing him, Todd. Right, Todd, try and, try and run around him. Run away, Todd, run away. Pivot, Todd, pivot. Then through the door. Through the door. Oh, God. Oh, he hit me from- he hit me through the door from behind? Thorn is now free <laughs> to do I'm crying now. <laughs> oh, dear. Oh, well, I was hoping I could lure him out and then I would kind of go around him. That was my thought. Mm. I think I've really enjoyed every single Todd- uh, every Todd Howard game I've ever played. Every single uh, Telltale game I've played I've enjoyed. I hope, so they've delayed Wolf Among Us a year, which I hope is a good thing and not a bad thing. I hope it's a good thing that they're going to make, you know, the game's going to come out and it's going to be really nice quality and it's not a bad thing that, you know, that they don't really have enough resources and the game isn't kind of turning out very well so they've had to delay it for a year. Maybe try leveling up. Yeah. I'm going to try, I'm going to give it one more go. I'm gonna give it one more go and then we will try. Oh, a Telltale Skyrim, that would be fun. You know, I was thinking a fun goal. When is the new Elder Scrolls coming out? That's, I'm not gonna say what my fun new goal was. Until until you until you answer my question.
Your dagger is broken. Who told me to do this? Which one of you? <laughs> Broke my fucking dagger, now I got nothing. Um, I got a long sword. Cannot equip this item. We could use a staff, I guess. We are a wizard. Oops. Oh! Backwards, backwards, Todd, backwards. Fire dart. I don't have any mana! No. <laughs> Squeeze past him, Todd. Oh. Hey, Mango. Good morning. The last thing I saw was him holding up his. Dang. Alright, maybe we'll go level up. I've never finished the first Wolf Among Us. I think the ending's the best part. The ending's really good. Mm -hmm. The Argonian made the protagonist. All right. God murdered a wolf. We'll heal ourselves. And then um, I suppose we'll just we'll just plod around and try and level up. What are they even parrying my bloody hits with? What are they? What are their teeth? <laughs> this is silly, lads. Now he's got a fucking friend as well. With you died our last. Their paws, their teeth. Tharn is now free to do as he will. It saddens me to see the beautiful land of... You know, this lady's the new bloody in. Roberta Williams. Goodbye. I wish you peace. I just made my hit the floor? That's shield. Todd is real... This is very, um... This is really, uh, really testing of Todd. <laughs> right, let's try that door again. Todd. Todd! <laughs> you died our last hope for justice. Tharn is now Maybe we should just play as a ghost. She gets to! God, she's like, she's so high and mighty for someone who's already fucking died. Alright. Is there defenses versus your hit chance? Oh. Oh, I didn't heal. Nuts. Nuts, 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 piss, 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 piss. With you died. With you died our last hope of justice. Oh, we don't want to load. No, I didn't want to load that one. Is this still the tutorial dungeon? No, 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 no. No, 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 this is a, we got a, a quest from a beautiful, beautiful queen. I forgot to heal again. <laughs> Todd, why aren't you hitting them? With you. <sighs> We're gonna be here. Basically, I think it's just RNG. I loaded the wrong one. I think I was one pixel off picking the right one. God murders it. Yeah, I feel like it's just it's just gonna be RNG until we uh because I think that's the door I need to get through. Why don't any of their hits miss? They seem to hit. Don't 
worry, Rain Man, we've made exactly one rat of progress. Maybe we should concentrate killing our rats. The wolves are in the way. Yeah, I gotta get through the wolves to get to the rats. Alright, let's go this way. I feel like I can't let the wolves win, you know? More rats. Okay, rat room. These rats aren't gonna... I don't know why I even check. The rat has anything in his pocket. Rats don't even have pockets. Nothing. I can hear more rats. Oh! Fun doors. Oh, rat. Rats can also give me brain fever, which I'm not a big fan of. I hate that I can't can barely click. Hey! Have a great day. Bravo, thank you so much. Thank you very, very much. Thank you very much for the donation. You have a great fucking day as well. You have a great Tuesday. Ooh, there's a pile of rats in here. Thank you so much. Thank you. I get a level. I gained five points. That's pretty. I'm having a great day now. My day's going great. That was very poggy. Right. Let's get our... Let's put our intelligence up by three. And then we got two more points. And the most efficient way... Most efficient thing to put that in is... Maybe I did, yeah. Luck. What does luck actually give me? Jean Luc Picard. I wanted to go into intelligence, I wanted a little bit of more of um bit more mana so that I could heal myself more. Now go fight the green man? I don't know, I stood up for ready. Ooh, six gold pieces, a ring, a buckler. Lovely. We should also save. Underneath. It'll oh, do. I kind of I don't like to save over my last save. Luck combines some chances it's not really worth it unless you go all out for it like all points. Oh, there's a bed. There's a bed. Wait, who came th Somebody opened the door. I heard someone open my door. Let's just camp for a while. Two. 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 You wake up. Alright, I think I think we're pretty safe to like until fully healed. <laughs> we needed that fifteen hours of sleep. Hey C D good afternoon. And then we'll save again. Uh, Todd levels up, Todd gets it up. Todd takes a nap. Okay. I got Todd's appearance on point. I thought so. I thought so. I thought he'd wear a crown, seeing as he's CEO. Entrepreneur, there's a naked man. Why are you always naked? Why is everybody always fucking naked in here? God, waiting outside somebody's bedroom is fucking rude. Oh, Jesus Christ. I think he's gonna kill me, lads. It's like a very muscular Homer Simpson. With you died our last hope for justice. Tharn is now free. I woke up. I just woke up. The beautiful land of Running away is not an option. Do you think Todd runs? No, no, no. It's a nudist colony of your intrude. <laughs> right, we're gonna we're gonna be prepared. 
I'm prepared for nude Homer Simpson. He's not out there. <gasps> he goes straight for me! Fucking hell! Fuck off, sir! With I might, I might have to run. Todd might have to run. <laughs> I think, I think Todd might have to run. Why do they make it so sexy? <laughs> Goddamn sexy games. Open the door. Todd, Todd, come on. Meow. Oh God. I can't open any of these doors. Todd, open the door. Open the door, Todd. Todd, we're back in a room again. Todd, we're back. <laughs> the pets are supposed to be safe. Into the water! Into the water, Todd! He won't follow you in the water. I just healed. Now that sleep was worth naught. Yeah, he's just like a bee. That's easy. He, he was yellow! Alright, I'm gonna I'm gonna load the game and I'm gonna go. I know the door that I've gotta head out of. Yeah, maybe he was going for a bumblebee look. Alright, would a bumblebee costume be considered a furry? Because bumblebees are furry. Or is it, does it, does it, is it like, um, I'll wait until Bread comes and ask Bread. Bread's um, our resident furryologist. CBT New game game thank you so much thank you so much for eight months thank you very much are you having a good tuesday how's your tuesday been? right todd straight out straight out todd through the door through the door good job todd good job todd you should have shut the door behind you but don't worry todd it's all right i can hear him i can hear him i can hear him into the water We're good. Oh, a key! <gasps> Is that to get in the orc room, do you think? Can't oh, pick it up, though. <laughs> Further away, Todd. Pick up the key. Todd, pick up the soap, Todd! Don't mind the, <laughs> the big burly minotaur behind you. Todd, can you not pick Todd? Todd, I'm gonna need... I'm gonna... How do I pick that up? I can't pick it... Todd's got Kia phobia. Maybe there's a button to look down? I don't think there is. Todd, could you just pick it up? Pilfer, maybe. Just selects a target for pilfering. <laughs> Need to equip the hand. I'm ready to pilfer. Pilfer the key, Todd. Walk over it. Face the other way. <laughs> Why is this so difficult? Pick up the key, Todd! I can't do anything because the the it changes, the cursor changes, the cursor changes. I can't. Maybe if I get in the water, get in the water, Todd. And then I like, I gotta, I gotta go up. I told stop. <laughs> Oh, 
pick up the key. Is this, is this a, how do I, is this a bug or is this a, it's very slippery. Because <laughs> he's too far away over here. He's too far away. He doesn't have long enough arms for that. I can hear the Minotaur losing its fucking mind over there. Some like Somewhere over there. Realms of Haunting. I'll put that on my list of games not to, <laughs> not to play then. Save and reload? I don't think it's... I think it's the cursor, though. Just seeing if there's anywhere on the screen where the cursor... Like, why does the cursor go out this far? Is it because I'm playing it in windowed mode? Alright, hang on. It is not because I'm playing it in window mode. The note. <laughs> it's, it's not. I changed it. I changed it. it didn't do anything. I reach, I'm dropping crumbs of food over my keyboard. I'm not. I'm dripping over my keyboard because my food is wet. Page down. End. Mm-mm. It's fun playing it on a touch screen. I feel like that might be easier, actually. Yeah, because you can, like... I I think it'd be better with a Wiimote. Alright, I'm tabbing out. I'm tabbing out. Yeah, that's probably a certain angle you can just about grab it. Arena. Um. All right, someone's got the same problem. I am not able to pick up even after spam clicking the key around the key. Anyone help me? <laughs> Picking up stuff in arena without up down looking as hard that's the only reply the only reply to somebody having the same problem as me is yeah picking up stuff in arena without up down looking is hard it's two years old i don't think anyone's coming back to it <laughs> just click on it from really far away really far away all right do you have- you've got a save here, I would not even? Thank you very much. Right. Oh my god. Oh no, it's doing this again. I've had this problem before. Okay. Oh! I wouldn't even thank you very much. I found it. I found an iron key. Todd is like stretching from far away. Hey, good morning, Herbal. Good morning. <laughs> completely unintuitive. Oh, completely intuitive. Well, then why aren't you playing Arena Rooks? Hmm? Hmm? Right, we could try the orc now. I all turned around though. I don't know what direction I'm facing. So I'm at work. I have you know. Right, right. I'll, I'll message your manager and see whether they agree that you're at work. I should say. Todd levels up. Todd takes a nap. Todd has long arms. <laughs> Only picks up keys with telekinesis. 
Maybe that's how he got his name, Todd Howhard. Maybe he doesn't use his arms, if you know what I mean. <laughs> Why is there a man? We, uh, we think that they're just, they're, like, just being given birth to here. I presume this is where I'm meant to use the key. Ring. Oh, I see. I don't know how to use... Oh, maybe the key will... Maybe the key will just be used. Open the door with an iron key. Oh my god, he's completely nude! This isn't the same man as earlier! The man earlier wasn't a dinosaur, was it? Is this the first dungeon? I guess the second, kind of, right? Dagger, he's got a new dagger. Nice. I'm going to save there. Minus the, yeah, first dungeon minus the tutorial dungeon. We've been having some trouble. We've had naked ball men. We've had orcs who are semi-naked, uh, clothed except for their legs, and naked T-Rex. This does seem like a nudist, nudist colony, right? Todd kills. Oh, Croc cameo. Always comes back to Croc, doesn't it? Oh, he hasn't even seen me, lads. He's just getting murdered behind the wall. Oh no, he has seen me. I mean, he's hitting back. That was very laggy. Oh, there's another, he's got a friend. Oh, I got three gold pieces. All right. I should have healed. I didn't, though. It's all right. Fucking boss fight. Fine. Might heal. Wait. Lovely jab. Wait. Right, has he got anything on him? Six gold pieces! See another lizard man. Oh, what's this? Nothing? Okay, set dressing. King Udom Noodles, welcome into the stream. Happy Tuesday. Alright, locks beyond my skills. Go for the door, please. Failure. Okay. I should save. I just don't like saving saving all the time. You know, we've already we've just killed some dinosaurs. Todd <laughs> kills more dinos. Oh my goodness, is that a uh, is that a wolf emote? I love wolf. How is Wolf? Oh, where did he go? God, he went back far. How is Wolf in the uh, in the new Star Trek Picard? Oh, my dagger's broken. Oh gosh. Right. Oh, it's Wolf's son. Oh, it's Gowron. Is it Gowron? Gowron. I like Gowron. He's all right. He's all right. I know. You know. I don't appreciate that he's so evil. <laughs> you see that? You know, he's a little bit mean. I prefer, oh, what's his name? Um, oh, General, I don't remember his name. He brings Worf into his family. Martok, yeah. I prefer General Martok. Come with one eye. I know I'm thinking of. Yeah, 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 the one that brings Worf into his family. Yeah, I like him. And then I like that he becomes the emperor. Well. He's cute. Ah, oh, lovely. Tog Ma Todd Magneto. This room and others nearly were uh, or offices. Look, nearby were offices at one time, but looting and decay have left them more shells. Is that a, is that a shisha thing? Is that what they, these are called? Like one of the... The thingy more whoops. 
I don't want to know what they were doing in these offices. Gowron got tricked by that Ferengi. I don't remember. So I haven't finished the next generation. It's in that. I finished Deep, Deep Space Nine. But I saw something. Yeah, I thought I did. I thought I saw his. Oh my god, why did you put away. Oh. My dagger? Where's my dagger? Where's my dagger? Are you why just I... a normal crocodile? Are you also just a normal crocodile that continues to be slandered and demeaned by a C tier British media personality and their retinue? You know, so, actually, C tier. Call yeah, the Boyle like Sisters that. Law That's Firm at 1 800 Dark Eyes today. Our team will make sure that you will be the one wearing crocs because you'll be rolling in the dough after we are done with them. Also, Esma would like your phone number. Reptiles are her new fetish. Call today to get the Scaly, justice sorry. you deserve today. All right, all right. That, yeah, that checks out with Esma. <laughs> Gullux, thank you very much. Gullux, how are you doing at home? Have we had book club yet? I can upload cycles if you want. It's uh, control F11, I think, isn't it? Nope, F12. What, you had yours running at 25,000? Let's see. Oh my god. Oh my god, I took him out with one punch! They should make an anime out of me. You get it, one punch man. <laughs> Get fisted, gobos! Get fisted! <laughs> <laughs> Nothing usable. How hard punching, yeah! Nothing usable. Quite excited for the Horizon Forbidden West DLC tomorrow. Ooh, what are they bringing out? What, um, do you know what the DLC is? I think we'll just go through the main door. I don't, I don't really want to hang around too long. Oh yeah, the laugh track redeemed. Greg didn't like the idea. Yeah, he, uh, he won on that one. He didn't like the idea of a laugh track. Hey, Persoy, thank you so much for the follow. Thank you, thank you. Oh, is that a bed? How did I get up? Don't remember how what jump was. Are they your hands? Yeah, what wrong with my hands? The 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 the, the lizard is just a suit. Bring it to Steam. Well they bought um what did they bring? Uh God of War to Steam. And it did really well, so I'm hoping that they they kind of, um, they see how well it did and they think that maybe we should do it again. The graphics are really nice. There is a jump button. But I don't remember it. Oh, Sherlock Holmes The Awakened is really good. We really, really enjoyed it. We finished it yesterday. Super, super good. Lizard is just using human gloves. Oh, my gosh. I can't touch them. I thought I thought it was a thing. Mm. They did just come out. It did. We uh we day one it. Oh, Rain Man. So I might, you know, I probably rank behind Madonna. I'm S tier, but like, but behind Madonna. Right. We're talking about, but Madonna's British, right? Yeah, The Last of Us remake came out on uh, PC. It didn't come out. <laughs> People didn't rate it very well. King Udon Noodles, thank you so much for the follow. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. Oh, the royal bedchamber. Are the daggers broken? Yeah. The daggers have fallen. Okay. I know what Trek is. So I've watched, uh, to give you a, a Trek, um... My my Trek background. <laughs> I've watched Voyager. I've watched Deep Space Nine. I am two to three um, seasons through the Next Generation. Um, I can't remember. I can't can't remember 
quite where I am in it. Um, but I, I'm, I've paused watching it at the moment because I started watching Buffy and Angel and I want to get them done before I go back to Trek. Um, I'm going backwards, essentially. I'm going to go Voyager, um, Deep Space Nine, Next Generation. Then is it Enterprise next? No, I think I'm saving Enterprise. And then it's the original series. I think. And then I get to go forward in time to Enterprise and so forth. I like the ending for Voyager. I liked it. Oh, gobos. Get punched. <laughs> there's, yeah, there's lower decks, isn't it? 27 gold pieces. Wow. Remake was planned for PlayStation 5 and PC at the same time. It's the third time the game's been released. I've, uh, I saw. Oh. CBT new. I've never seen her, never seen her before. Stealthy, thank you so much for 18 months. A year and a fucking half. Stealthy, thank you so much. Thank you, thank you. Stealthy, how are you doing? How's your day been? What's your day been? The original 60s Trek had an energy never matched. I did uh, also, I don't want Todd kills more dimes. Oh, yeah, that's fine. Todd punches gobbles. I did, uh, did order that. Star Trek anim Star Trek anime figure. Just if any anyone was in any question or whether I was actually gonna pre-order that, I did. <laughs> I did indeed pre-order that. Um, they are doing a Star Trek anime figure. Um, I've got a picture of it on my Twitter. Not so like, not to make you go over to my Twitter, but it's I don't think it's very far down. I don't tweet that often. Um. They've done like an anime girl version of Spock. It's, I, it's really nice. It's really cute. Uh huh. Yeah, I pre ordered the Spock waifu. Oh, Brad, I had a question for you. I had a very important question. If you are wearing a, a bee, costume oh dear are you is it is that a furry thing or it does that because bees are furry or is that more of the insect or is that like a, a venn diagram in the middle between insect and furry yeah it is cute isn't it i couldn't i couldn't resist and i'm really really hoping that they bring out more <laughs> of the like the crew apparently they got two more planned so what would they do? Like Spock, um, maybe Scotty, maybe Scotty, Spock, um, I don't know. They, I think they've got three from the original. Yeah, but I was just thinking that, um, bees are quite furry themselves. Delphi, how is your, oh, it has been a good day. Beautiful weather outside. Oh, you're going, out, going outside? But what about that nice dungeon town? <laughs> you can't go outside. Gamers don't leave the house. Got a doggy waddling around, being really fucking irritating. Snowed here this morning. When does it stop snowing for you? Surely it should be... Is it not? How warm is it? <laughs> Actually, it's not. Is it not warm enough? Uh, Todd punches more. Those. Yeah, now you say it. It is pretty cold for April. This chest is moldy. Heard that before. Pilfer. Pilfer, please. I think I have to go further back. Failure. I said it was no match for me. Pilfer. I'm trying to pick the lock. Is th this is how I pick locks, right? I pil- oh, there we go. I pilfer until it opens. 50 si Oh, a kite shield. Let's have a look. So at the moment we've got like a round shield. Oh, can't use the kite shield. It'll be good to sell later. The human skin gloves are creepy. Ooh, this is a nice bed. Should we? <gasps> no, get out of my bed. 
God, you're rude. Buy me a fucking drink first before you try getting into Todd's bed. Fucking rude gobbos. Oh, new dagger though. Honestly, the fists are much better than the dagger. I'm kind of reluctant to <laughs> reluctant to change. I guess the dagger gives me a bit more range. Well, here. There was I saw there was another. Some chocolate milk. I think Todd like would like some chocolate milk. I don't know. I think Todd is more of a kind of banana milk or strawberry milk kind of person. <gasps> Old uh, folded sign reads the king. Oh, oh. Now let me back away and reread that. Long swords are forbidden. Ah, the long sword was going to go for four hundred gold, so I might sell it. Uh, we, the last survivors of the court of Stonekeep, are heading south through the Goblin Caves. Goblin Caves, Goblin Caves. Alright, I guess I will also head south through the Goblin Caves. Oh, I can hear, like, moaning. Oh. Ah! That dagger's already fucking broken. I only used it once. Oh. Oh, I'm angry. <laughs> I only used it once. Bloody lizard man broke my dagger. Oh, there's, there's fucking hundreds of them. Hang on. We might be able to punch from far enough away. They, oh dear, they can also reach me. Back away, Todd. Back away. Right, Todd's gonna have a little nap. It's Breath of the Wild. Todd, we're just gonna have a little nap, Todd. We're gonna sleep. You can't camp enemies nearby. Alright, we gotta punch. Punch some dinosaurs. Where are they? Come here. I also recently did a Star Trek puzzle. <laughs> Just now, I, now my mind's only on Star Trek. No thoughts, only Star Trek. Have I finished the puzzle? I did finish it. I did. It took me ages though. I think it took me like three days. It was a long one. 24 gold pieces! Whoa, and a dagger! That's gonna break in five seconds. That's good. The unarmed Viking badass character. <laughs> so because my daggers keep breaking. It's I promise it's not intentional. Can I camp now? Camp until fully healed? I know. Ah, there we go. Yeah, one thing I I dislike is I kind of wish I wish games had an option for a uh, weapon or something that didn't break. It's like in Stardew when you finally get the golden uh, like. The golden watering can and whatever but it can still break because i think uh it gives a good option for people who don't enjoy don't know why i switched that maybe don't enjoy doing uh weapon breaking thing fred you have a good time or as good of a, as good of a time as you can have fred i'll see you in a minute <laughs> todd versus the gobbos these uh these gobbos represent Todd's uh <laughs> Todd's employees. They're all asking for raises and Todd has to fight them off. God. 
They said south. And I'm not going south. Ah! There's the nude! There's the nude orc! There's the nude orc. He's got no trousers on. He's got no trousers on. Wait, let's, uh, let's go this way. I think we're back. Oh, fuck! Why there's so bloody many of them? Oh, I think this is a dead end, lads. Oh, Lance. Maybe they won't see me. Face them? How did you, does anyone remember how I jump? What's the, what's the button? Jump. Because that would be really helpful if I could just jump. Brave the badger ran away. A dumb space, maybe. Why are we whispering so the orcs don't hear us? Run, don't run. Don't run. We gotta stop getting caught on the pause, Don. With you died our last hope for justice. I don't even know what killed me. Tharn is now free to do as he wills. It saddens me to see the beautiful land of Tamriel rotting. Spider? I've never seen a spider before in my life. I've ne I, we've never encountered spiders before. Probably just sleep for another 20 hours. Honestly, that's fair. Like, they do seem to respawn. Right, Todd punches gobbos. Todd punches more gobbos. Perhaps the last time we... Okay, right. We left off, we were pilfering. God, could you just, could you, could you just, could you please just open this chest, Todd? Punch the chest, Todd. Punch the chest! This Todd trying to get more money. This hurts! This does my, does my health in! Todd trying to get more money for Skyrim. He's roughing up this chest. <laughs> Buy Skyrim again! <laughs> Got a belt as well. How's everyone pooping? Not pooping too badly. A little bit constipated. But that might be the anti-inflammatories. I think uh, I think they were supposed to mess up my delicate stomach. Oh, you got a pleasant one, Mister West. I know you've had to you've, you've had some difficult poops recently. It's Skyrim VR. What do you think the best Elder Scrolls game is? Bro, have you played all of them? You even played the Switch version. Todd, Todd got you, bro. Todd got you. There are enemies nearby. Oh, for f right, we're gonna have to heal. Oh, don't tell, don't tell Todd that, bro. You bought every one of them. Daggerfall's really good, but Morrowind, you think? Not Oblivion? Oblivion's a fan favorite. I like how the the sound pops every time we punch as well. I really enjoy that. It's like I've got I've got some popcorn popping in my brain every time we punch someone. Okay, nothing usable. I'm sure somebody's got some gold on them or did. There's three of them here, but I'm not sure I can sort like I can't sort through the bodies. Lot of chili. 
<laughs> oh no. Oh no, I bet that's fucking spicy coming out as well. Morrowind plus one. Daggerfall's good as well. Did anyone say anything um, with regarding the new Elder Scrolls game? All right, we want to go south. Let's um, let's be sensible about this. Eat more vegan food, so my stomach is confused. <laughs> it's like mm, this isn't beef. The Richmond vegan sausages are really good if you can get hold of those. Uh, you, you'll have to eat them for me because I'm allergic to them, so I have to live vicariously through you now. <gasps> oh, I don't like the skeletons! These, The skeleton! Oh my god, they fucking hit hard! I didn't save because I didn't think we were going to be in trouble. With you died our last... I didn't think we were going to have a problem. I didn't, I just... We were full health. We were full health. I thought, oh, great, this will be fine. I, I didn't save. I didn't save. <sighs> I'm really hungry today. Now we've spoken about um, fucking Richmond sausages. That's all I can think of. I have one boiled sweet here, like the true old lady I am. Skelly boys are beefy. Yeah, for their lack of beef on their on their skelly. <laughs> Ma. You know, I'd like a um I'd like a version of that redeem to be Rhea as well. Telling me how uh like how What's the word? Disappointed she is in me. Because we've got Roberta. There we go. Mm -hmm. Oh, right. You look at the sky and you hear nothing but incest. Freudian slip. Wonder if Roberta can be found on Cameo? I I thought she did do something like that. <laughs> then the dragons spawn in. Or dinosaurs. You know, I've thought about playing Persona 5 in my own time. You know, for all I say about Persona 4 being a being a bit of a being a bit of a slog. It's all right, the dinosaurs don't hurt me too much. I'm playing 13 Sentinels at the moment, if anybody anybody's played that. It's a, I get a JRPG with some like um, RTS elements, but not, su like not super RTS-y. Greg got it for me for Christmas, and it's take it's taking me this long this long to actually play it. Another lizard man. Mmm, right. oh, it's It's really good if you enjoyed um. Three houses. You'd probably enjoy Thirteen Sentinels. That's why he got it for me because I really enjoyed Three Houses. Um, Todd is fully is is healthy. We should probably check to see if we are healthy. We are healthy. Good. Cool. Cool. Mm -hmm. It's good fog. I'm really enjoying it. It's a bit weird. Like uh, if you've watched Steins Gate, it's a little bit like 
you know, when someone asks you what's it about, I don't know if I could tell you what's it, what it's about. But I can tell you that I'm having a good time. Hmm. The downtime is slightly different and there's more variety, but the overall story is kind of the same. I think that might be how much stuff Todd's carrying on him. Or how much stuff Todd can carry. Todd's a very strong boy. Strong boy. Do, 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 do. Let's try this dagger that's probably going to break as soon as I use it. Alright. Let's head south. I think I just wouldn't mind the gu uh, the oh dear, something's hitting me. Jesus Christ on a bike. What is hitting me? Oh my god, it's a skeleton. My dagger's fucking broken, of course. And I can't move either. I'm stuck for some unknown bloody reason. What kind of bike? Tandem bike with your mum. Hope you saved. I did save. Don't worry, I did. I'm a Todd. Fists. Maybe I should do a fist only run of this bloody. Like, at this point, that's what we're already doing. Yeah, I was. I was gonna say. I think I'd enjoy the grinding in Persona a little bit more if I wasn't streaming it. Might not be so boring. All right, we're still stuck, though. Oh. We're still stuck. Um, I think we might be stuck in a wall, lads. Yeah, we might have to reload, but, like, I just won. Just chose a monk or barbarian. I can, like, let me have a look. Arena. Elf Gold Arena jump. Because we might be able to jump our way out. He's kinder to our mums than Badger. Hey, look. I love mums. Arena. Uh, jump. With the mouse controls, the higher the cursor, the farther the jump. But what is the jump button? Is it this one? That's why I couldn't hit you from inside a wall. No, I cheated. Oh, he's got a dagger on him as well. <laughs> um. Control F1. There we go. This doesn't really, really tell me much. <laughs> right. That didn't tell me much. Um... I just want to know what button it's mapped to. You know, sometimes I really hate the internet. I just, I just really hate it because it's so... Like it, all I want to know, I like, I type in Elder Scrolls Arena jump. And all I want to know is the jump button. But the, the fucking internet's like, oh, let me tell you how to remap the buttons. No, I don't want to remap them. I just want to know which button it's already mapped to. Apparently shift J, which is incorrect. I really don't want to reload, lads. Aha! 
We're still stuck. Is there like a forward jump? A running jump? Right click while left mouse button is pressed. Yeah, it looks like I might have to reload. Just works now. Just works. God, if I wasn't such a hacker man and didn't hack the game, you know? I'm kidding, Todd, I haven't hacked an actual game. Okay, so Todd's watching. I don't want to get sued by Todd. We already know how hard Todd is. You wouldn't hack a car. Oh, Jesus Christ. Happening again. Let's keep running, Badge. Just keep running. Keep running, Badge. Oh, God. He one hit killed me. Yeah, but I think I could only beat the skeleton because I, like... Because I was trapped in the wall. That's teleport spells. <laughs> That's almost worse because they expect them. I get stuck. Todd, Todd too thick. Will Todd's too... His booty is too thick. He can't make it through. He can't like shimmy past the skeletons. Todd, you wouldn't Todd a car. Have you broken this game? No, no, it's meant to be like this. This is all working as Todd intended. I fell into the wall again, lads. It's lads, it happened lads, it's happened again. I'm in I'm in the wall. Once again, lads, and I'm being hit in the booty by something. I don't know what, because I can't see anything. I've fallen uh, once again, I'm in the wall. I'm starting to doubt this title of Todd is healthy. Todd, run! Todd, run like the fucking wind! Don't look back! Oh god, what is that? No! <laughs> Ow, my hip! Sorry. My hip came out of the socket. Aye, aye, aye! Aye, aye, aye. Sorry, it's right. I popped it back in. Yeah, I'm alright. <laughs> Let me just get out of this painkiller. Do I know how to skeleton know? These skeletons, I saw them and hit straight out. Oh, God. Right, just can't move now. <laughs> yeah, skeletons and open out. Alright. Let's go. Uh Todd is healthy. Todd's healthy, but batter isn't. Need to do those pre stream warm ups. <coughs> oh, fuck. Kill the skeletons. Punch him. Todd, punch him. <laughs> How am I actually meant to do this? Like, um. Anyone ever seen a 16 year old cat with the zoomies? Holy moly. Oh. I saw him. I don't know. Is this depressing? Am I doing the Reddit thing where I post a picture of a cute cat and then I tell a miserable story? It's not miserable. 
I um I read this story about this cat that had um an appointment to put down because it was it was refusing food, it wasn't um you know, they it was really sick. The owner, like then on its last day, fed it some like they were like, Okay, this is your last day, you can eat whatever you want. And they fed like they managed to get the cat to eat cheese. You know, eat some cheese. Um, I think there might have been some McDonald's fries involved. And then it was apparently like a miracle that the next day the cat was just kind of was back to normal doing zoomies and everything. So they had to cancel the they had to cancel the uh, the cat getting put down because <laughs> it was fine. Just needs a needed a bit of McDonald's. <laughs> I think that's a happy story. Right, Todd. Run, Todd. Oh, fuck's sake. How am I supposed to do this? I feel like me trying to cheese it. McDonald's saves lives. It does. It's all I eat. Your luck with equipment is rotten. In my save, I was level four and I had an elephant weapon already. Oh, well, I have. I've got two Algonian weapons. How's that? <laughs> 27! Must have been very well taken care of. I think, uh, I think my cat might have lived to, like, 20-something. Let's hope this is hitting them. Oh, she's good. Who didn't really? Um, let's look through our weapons, see if we've maybe got a bow. Maybe you haven't a sword before. I can't equip it though. I can't equip it. I don't have anything that I can. I can equip a staff. Still did the fastest 180s I've ever seen. Oh baby. We've got a dagger. It's broken. It's gonna it's gonna break after one hit, but we do have one. Maybe we'd have some like bow and arrow. Maybe we could we could uh maybe we try with a staff. You know, what does Todd love if not his staff, right? We'll try with staff and maybe we'll try to do some we'll do, do, do some magic on them. We are we have uh, you know we've got wizard points after all. Get up. Oh, okay. I don't really even know how to use the staff. But like here? Do I like send out fire darts? One thing I love about old games is just the lack of tutorials. Makes it really exciting. You never, you never know. You just hit people with the staff. Is that it? Like it's just... I became I become an old man hitting people with my walking stick. That's I thought it was gonna be a magic staff that I Can I first fire spell at the target? Oh Does that work? Is he is he damaged? I don't know. I hope so. You're supposed to read the physical manual or pay for the hit lines, either or. I hit the wall. Fantastic. That's just great, isn't it? Now turn. Turn and fight. Stand and fight, Todd. Stand and fight. All right. Well, hit them, Todd. Hit them. <laughs> hit them with your rhythm stick. Hit them hard and hit them quick. Oh my god. They relied on the manual. No one has time to read a book about a game now, though. That's true. I don't know. You know, game guides sell pretty well. I did do damage. I think I hit them with the fireball. And I hit them with my stick at least twice. So that's three hits I got. Not Todd kills rats. Piss. I found with a, without the use of my pointer finger, my substitute pointer finger, which is my middle finger, now seems to um, it seems it seems to have a little bit of a mind of its own. That I ask it to click somewhere and it, it clicks somewhere else. 
It, that also keeps me guessing a little bit. Right, Todd. Right, let's uh, let's give you a staff, I suppose. Drake the Snake, thank you so much for the follow. Thank you very much. Welcome in. Hit them with your laser beam, Todd. I think we will just use magic on them. Can I seduce the skirts? <laughs> but I have to roll a charisma check on that. Oh dear, Todd. Oh, Todd. Right. Todd, fire dart. Fire dart at the skeleton, Todd, and now hit them with your stick. And then fire dart again, Todd, at the target of the skeleton. Oh, I died, you feeding a skeleton! Did I defeat both of them? Has he got anything on him? Yeah, 36 gold pieces! Right, we save, yeah. I don't know if, okay, we save. We defeated one. Use the Yerden, Geralt! Use the Yerden! Todd kills his first skeleton. I kind of hate the, the wizardry in this because it's really, it's kind of a bit slow and clunky. Oh, the other skeleton hit me. Oh, fire dot. With you died our last hope for justice. Tharn is now free to do as he will. It's sad my kingdom heart strategy guide. My mom was never clever enough to give me a complicated JRPG and force me to read so I could finish it. In the afterworld. <laughs> Did you guys? Todd painted us some nice art. Get a better computer. <laughs> what is that? What does that mean? <laughs> Insufficient RAM. I've got lots of RAM though. I'm like, uh, you know, I've I've got so much RAM. You'd think it was a sheep farm in here. <laughs> Download more RAM. Memory leaks. Oh shit! Am I gonna have to clean that up? Oh my god! Right, hang on. You look at the dog. Oh, who is licking her butt right now? Oh, and it crashed. Okay. Well, good. Good. It's gonna it's gonna take a minute before. It realizes it's crashed. A <laughs> really classic Bethesda. <laughs> Susan, can you like, can you, I know your bum is, you know, you really want it clean, but could you just? I hope the safe isn't corrupted. Oh, I'm gonna be very like, if, if, all right. You hear this right here and now. If the save is corrupted, we're playing cars. Cause life's a highway. It's got twists and turns, but you're going to ride it all night long, all right? Deal. You wouldn't download a RAM. <laughs> right, you ready, Mr. West? We've already had the lottery one. We've had the best fortune today. Please be corrupted. Please be corrupted. <laughs> Daddy likes to sit on my lap and clean our ass. So I don't say. Fog, how are you feeling today? How how are you feeling? How's the, how's the COVID? How's the Rona? We could finally download cro download cars. I want those uh, cars Crocs. Yeah, the Lightning McQueen ones. There's a prospect of a thrilling time ahead of you. Well, I mean, you are watching this stream, so that's kind of a given, right? That's kind of a given. Yeah, it was quite a long one. Hey, Bread, good morning, Bread. The game broke, Bread. Is the safe corrupted Ogre Oracle? It is certain. Well, if it's corrupted, we're playing cars. <laughs> Dogs don't use toilet paper, so must resort to their tongue. She gets washed. <laughs> oh, we're fucking itching our ear. The funniest thing about her itching her ear is sometimes she gets angry at her foot. 
I'm gonna wait and see whether we get to witness that. She gets angry at her foot for not, like, either getting the scratch correctly. And then she'll bite her foot. Oh, we get angry. Oh. Vox Janen! Thank you so much for the follow. Thank you very much. Welcome in. No, she's not having it. She's embarrassed. Oh, sleepy time. Right. Todd is healthy. Oh, all right. <sighs> it worked. You know, I was hope I was hoping for some cars as much as the next person. Kane, I don't know what that means. <laughs> I don't know what that means. Is it like a like a plot that you propagate? think he saved but oh yeah wait yeah 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 you're right Todd kills his first skeleton you're right yeah they put myself back life is in fact not a highway <laughs> but I want him to come around the corner come on come at me bro come at me come on yeah. Oh, he's coming at me. <laughs> I mean, I did. I healed by accident. I healed. I clicked the wrong one. Ah! Kill him, Todd. Kill him. <laughs> With you died our last hope for justice. Tharn is now free to do as he wills. It saddens me to see the beautiful land of Camriel rotting. Oh, I had to change my password at work this morning. It takes 15 minutes to tell the rest of the network that, ch oh, network that changes to happen. Oh, that makes sense. That makes sense. See, I was thinking I, I was I was here for all the plant, like the plant lingo. Let me try again. No, Todd, Todd, why is your ass so fucking thick? Right, we might want to heal this time. It is a bit of a waste of our mana, Todd. Send the, send the spell, Todd. The spell, another one. Not enough spell points, Todd, no! <laughs> With you died our last time oh, Fred, I hope it works. Tharn is now free to do- Is it supposed to be, is it a good drug? Is it a good one? Let's try again. Right, we wanna, we wanna, we wanna go past and we wanna turn. So we wanna turn and fight and then we click quickly. And then we fire dart at the skeleton, and then we click quickly. And we fire dart at the spell the skeleton, the skeleton again, and the skeleton's dead. And then we save. We killed our second skeleton. Good. Todd kills again. And then, I'm not sure if we've looted the skeleton yet. Good dagger or bad dagger? See, our problem now is that we don't have much health. We don't have any way of healing. Uh, I think he's only gonna last one hit. It's pretty, like, it's pretty shitty dagger. Oh, Jean, thank you so much for the follow. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. Welcome in. I consider playing the old school Bard's Tale series. I haven't. I, I have to admit, I don't know too much about it. There was fresh blood on it. I can't. I was hoping I could pilfer. <laughs> hoping we could do a bit of grave robbing. Have a 1% crit chance per level. Our success chance in fights would seem to be about 4%. Ooh, wee. I mean, that's not the worst. Wait, what are we here? What what are we doing here? This kind of looks like a rat king. 
similar to my current meds, but for some reason the extended release doesn't work. Oh, we're trying to Ritalin extended release. So does that mean it's like a, it's a bit of a grower rather than a immediate release? Doesn't seem to be anything down there, lads. The helm looks good. I can't pick it up though. Maybe I can pick it up. It's, you know, it has to be pixel perfect. So let's uh, let's try and pilfer. I'm gonna. I think I might take a nap. Can I jump up here? Hold down this, and then this. Hold down this, and then jump. There we go. And pivot, Todd. And we're gonna take a nap up here. There are enemies nearby. Oh, fuck. Did they. Did more skeletons respawn in? Oh no, they're wolves. And I'm stuck in a wall again. No, we're good. We freed ourselves. Where did the wolves even bloody come from? Was I not even meant to be in here? Hey. Maybe I let's oh, woo! I can't even remember what I'm actually searching for. I don't I don't remember what the beautiful queen wanted me to look for, to be perfectly honest. She was just like, brave Sir Todd, off you go. The broke part behind the royal bedroom? Part behind the royal bedroom. Right, so I'm in the royal bedroom. Let's go to sleep again. Let's go to sleep in the royal bed. Todd get good. Oh, yeah, like a more consistent. More consistent ability to do stuff rather than just having having short bursts of being able to do it. I get you, bread. I get you. I have a similar thing with them. Um, okay, obviously not the same thing. But I sometimes have a similar thing where um, I can... <laughs> We have to strategize my window of not feeling too tired to do something. So if Greg needs me for something, like uh, he, he, need, he needs me to sign off on a piece of merch or something, or he needs me to like do like do, just you know do, do, just do something, um, I'm like right, give me a coffee, and then we have one hour. <laughs> we have one hour from the point I have the coffee. To me being able to do the thing that we need me to do. And then I'm going to need to go take a nap, alright? We're looking for the thing so the queen can translate another thing. I am, yeah. Okay, I remember. She's paying me and, um, paying me by being able to translate. I was expecting it to be cheese. Right, Greg, you give me a piece of cheese and I can do the piece of work that you need me to do. Maybe through here? Have we been through here? Usually I am, we could go this way, because that was a dead end. Let's try the other way then, lads. I'm usually at my best around kind of one, because I've essentially trained myself to being awake for stream. And then it just, it goes downhill from then. <laughs> I'm usually most awake around stream time. I don't want to go that way. Can I go? I'm going to kill him. I'm going to kill him. No orc is going to get the better of me this time. Where did my dagger go? Why does this always happen? God, I think he should automatically... Oh, I'm stuck. Okay. I think Todd should automatically get his dagger out. Uh, no, his fists out. If his dagger breaks, Todd, just get your, get the fists out immediately, okay? I'm already dead. When you die, that... <sighs> the trees from it.
Oh. Todd kills again. All right, let's go back to Todd kills again. Let's uh, let's head back to the bedroom. We'll take a nap in the bedroom, and then we will we'll go the other way. Todd's dagger. Do it does have fucking performance problems. I don't know what is like why I am so unlucky that I get these daggers that are good for one hit. And then they're like, then, then they're not good anymore. Go to sleep. Go to sleep. I do like, are they pa are these pan pipes? I need a saber or a short sword. I haven't been offered one of those though. <laughs> I've got a staff. <laughs> Cause Todd loves his staff. Right Todd, we're just, we're gonna start using magic. It's a kind of magic, magic, magic. Ow. Todd, we're all, we're already out of magic. We're already out of fucking mana. Oh god, and he's not dead. Yeah! <laughs> all right, let's hope it's uh, hope we get lots of points. Five, six. Alright, we're incredibly unlucky with our weapons, but we are incredibly lucky with how many points we get. Right, so I am going to... <sighs> Maybe agility. Maybe all in luck. I will save, don't worry. I will save. Let's go to two, two in agility. I want more in intelligence. And then with our two bonus points, let's up our persuasion. No, 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 he actually, he came with this name, Fog. <laughs> he named, he came with this name. His mum, his mum gave him his, this name. Oh, bread, have you finished it yet? Have you finished a run? What do I want with personality? I just think that if maybe Todd had a little bit more Riz, maybe we wouldn't get attacked so often. Maybe we could, you know, uh, barter with the gobos. You know? And, and if they kill me, they'll say, well, at least he had a good personality. For the boxing ability, we could put we could put some points into boxing order strength. You can, you can't raise enemies in this game. That's the oh you can't. That's the next game. Maybe we take. It. I just I wanted to get it up to sixty. Could put in the strength. This feels like such a. But we'll put two into strength. All right. The Miz has got the Switch version and now I'm playing it too. Do you have a do you have two switches, Brad, or do you <laughs> do you steal? Right. Todd kills again. Todd kills his first skeleton. Todd makes a profit. Let's swap out Todd. Todd makes a profit to Todd. Um this. Let's see if they've got anything good on them. Nothing. Nothing. Okay. And the other one? They're laying on top of each other. Come on, lads. How am I supposed to pickpocket you if you're all over each other? I 
could heal up here. I could jump up here and heal. No? Oh. Oh, Toad, jump. No. Come on, Toad. <laughs> Todd is only um how tall was Todd? I don't think he's particularly tall. Ah! Get away! Get away! Oh, oh he's dead! Oh you know what? This staff seems to work better than the dagger. I see another wolf. Where there's one wolf, there's more wolves, so we back away. We're gonna walk the other way. Is there another way? This is the way I came. Maybe not. <laughs> Fucking horror game with all these jump scares! Yeah, go Todd! We are not doing very well on health. Todd is not looking super healthy. Todd hasn't been eating his kale, eating his vegetables. I think we gotta just try and heal at least. Raising agility help, that's what I was hoping. I was hoping I'd get more hits in. Oh. Right, where are we headed? Yeah, the staff seems pretty good. I like it. It just seems like a dagger would be more useful, you know? You know, do you want to use big stick to kill people with, or do you want to use sharp knife? I feel like sharp knife usually would uh would seem a bit better. Can I camp here? I don't know where the enemies are, and I definitely don't have enough health to face them. Hope they're in the other direction. Oh, uh, rat! Oh, I do one shot. One shotting these ro rodents. These Romans. <laughs> like now can I? Yeah. Oh no. I got a little bit of a heal on. Not much though. You reckon I can like do a little heal now? Oh! Nice. What do we got in here? I think you should heal. Don't worry, I got, a, I got enough just to do a little heal. Oh my god, this stick is amazing! I should say, right? Todd is a fucking beast. Todd kills again. Todd levels up his fists. I'm gonna save. Todd becomes the beast. Uh, that's beast. That's fine. That <laughs> Todd becomes the beast. <laughs> it's good enough. Good enough. <laughs> the beast. <laughs> I'm sure that means something. Right? Does that mean anything? Is that a word that means anything to anyone? I'm going the wrong way. Of course I am. That's what she said. I think maybe I'll just keep leveling up my agility. It seems nice. Seems pretty good. Right, let's turn and see if we can heal. Oh, I can hear. I can literally hear an enemy. I'm not going to be able to. Sod <laughs> the beast. <laughs> no, yeah, yeah. How hard? I nearly said Howard. That would suggest that Todd has a relation to somebody al alive or dead, which he does not. Okay, we're going through the sewers. Beast is a terrifying entity that attacks young children <laughs> and makes them buy Skyrim. <laughs> 
common myth states that the, he is the boogeyman, but the beast is actually far different from him, in that he actually exists. <laughs> like the boogeyman, though, is often used to threaten unruly children into performing chores or doing their homework. <laughs> Do your own work or Todd's gonna come get you! <laughs> Todd's gonna come and- <gasps> SOME NAKED PEOPLE TO YOU! NAKED MAN! God, why are they always so nude? You died our last hope for justice. Tharn is now free to do as he Why are they all so nude? Do they not want to, like, make, um... They don't want to make, uh, sprites with clothes on? Todd becomes the beast. He'll make you buy Skyrim. <laughs> He'll do it, he's not afraid! You trespass different parts. <laughs> One hit by ghouls. Right. That's a... Uh... It's just, you know, like... It's strange that it's happening more than once is all I'm saying. That, you know, one naked enemy I can understand. But every enemy is naked. It's a little bit, you know, it's becoming a bit of a, a, a thing, you know? Let's just keep going. Oh, I can't. something against nudists no nothing nothing against i mean when they're killing me yes actually um can i i'll rescind them i'll rescind that no i mean in general though no because i mean todd would just say they're more you know they're all customers you know doesn't matter how clothed they are, they've got- <laughs> Oh, no, maybe Todd doesn't like nudists because they don't have pockets to put their money in to buy Skyrim. So maybe, maybe that's canon that Todd does not like nudists. Three gold pieces. And clearly they do have some pockets. Another buckler. I suppose they always got the old prison pocket. Left or right? He wears a stone dress for Fight Club. <laughs> I guess, though, you know, you'd be more slippery, right? If you were in a Fight Club, imagine. Nude, oiled up. Nude. Oh. With you I didn't even see my assailant. Justice. You're gonna be a lot harder to fight. Um, Todd becomes the beast again, I guess. Move from there. Oh. Huh? Alligator skin pocket. Oh, we haven't been here. Maybe we have? Have we been here before? Is this the king's bedroom? Oh, I heard someone come in. Oh, there's a door over there. Oh, yeah! Please, Todd. Just... Are we missing every single one? There we go. There we go. But we don't have enough to heal. 
Nothing usable. Uh, I'm still here. Okay. I'm still um, trapped. It seems like I've got I've gone somewhere I've gone a different way. Over here. And I don't know. I don't know where I am. I'm a little bit lost. I'd like to heal. Can I heal in here? Can I heal on these beds, maybe? Oh, you're gonna go see that. You're gonna see Chris Pine. Bread, make sure you wave at him for me. Hey, guide dog UK. Well, how are you doing today? Happy Tuesday. Tuesday. Uh, I'm so free. <laughs> Is this the dungeon master? I don't feel like a dungeon master. I feel like a bit of a dungeon noob. I've heard good things. I've heard good things about the D&D movie. I've heard Chris, you know, Chris Pine told me that his, you know, the best friends, um, that he's the best part of the movie. I'm healed after 37 hours. What game is this? This is uh, Elder Scrolls Arena, the OG Elder Scrolls. The original, before Daggerfall, before Morrowind. Before there was Skyrim. Chris Pine is my favorite of Chris's. My favorite. I suppose I'd have to say he was my. Uh, is, it, is Chris Evans an option? Chris Evans is pretty good, but I do like that Chris Pine got spat on by Harry Styles. That's uh, one of my favorite of his uh, personality traits. The lock is an insult to my abilities. Success. I don't want to go back to this. I don't I don't want to be in here. Maybe I go right then cuz it does look like there's a door to the right. Can I write stuff? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I should maybe save as well. I didn't realize writing on the map was an option. <laughs> wow. I can write really highly intelligent things on the map now. Uh, Todd takes a nap. Todd has long arms. Is it probably maybe long arms that we're replacing? Um... Oh no, we're on the right. Todd, Todd is always right. Numbering would make that easier. But that's half of the excitement, right? If you don't, if you're not sure. If you're never sure what you're gonna reload on. What's this? Can I open this? You are amused by this lock. Oh ho ho! Right, skeletons. Come on, Todd. Come on. Yes. Good job, Todd. Keep going, Todd. Use your stick. I just have really bad luck. <gasps> Has he got anything on him? He's got any money on him. Dank smell of mold and decay rise through the flooded dungeon. And again, we better save. I, I could number this one, I guess. Would you like that? I'll number this one. Now I know that that's the number five. This. Oh! <laughs> Great. 
great. Now we know how the um, the skeleton ended up there. It's uh, to the left or through the middle? Start with one. Nah. Oh, up you go. I did. I did think about putting sixty nine, but I thought that was too predictable. And then I thought, what's everybody's favorite number? Five, right? <gasps> Go over here. Oh! This is interesting. We haven't been through these doors before. 96! <laughs> back to back to cut. It's kind of cute. <laughs> it's like a cuddle when you're angry at each other. Hilfa. Asked ahead. Oh no. You're just asking someone to fart on you then. I suppose maybe you are. Where are we headed? So slippery. What's that noise, lads? You know, I don't like zombies. But, you know, let's just hope it's, it's you know. Go, keep a bit back. You died our last hope for justice. Okay. Farn is now free to do as he will. It's How much to be farted on? <laughs> Why mean you do it for free when you're on public transport, don't you? Todd! Jersey Milk, welcome into the- Welcome into the stream! This is Todd Howhard. No affiliation to anyone dead or uh, alive. We should probably avoid the ghouls. See, I know that I've got to start from five now. Good thing I numbered them, eh? Right, where am I? Where have we reloaded? I think I want to go this way. Todd Howhard, yes. <laughs> he is a night, night, night stalker, night, night, night walker, night, light shade. I can't remember what he is. He's the he's the wizard burglar. Oh dear. Maybe actually. Oh my god! Did he just hit me? For With you died our last hope. Oh, it's great. <laughs> it's great. I really, I like how whenever I die, this lady pops up and she tells me that our last hope has died with you. So she makes me feel really guilty for dying. Even though she herself already is already dead. He burgles wizards, yes. Look, those wizards, they got too much, they got too much money on them. Red, I'm redistributing the wealth of the wizards. She's actually in the process of falling from the sky. Hey, RK, good morning. You know, RK, you nearly missed the ultimatum that we might have played cars if the uh, we had a save or um, the game crashed. And we said if the save had corrupted, we'll load up cars. Let's play cars instead. Oh, no! I was hoping maybe I could get him. Let's try from over here. Yeah, I was thinking I'd like some options. Um, You know, we've obviously got the Roberta Redeem. We should have a Last Hope one, and then we should have um, the Stauff ones. You know, are you feeling lonely, Carl? Or, you know, with, with your parents' siblings. Can't remember the exact, uh, the exact words he uses, but to such an effect. Is there a lot of intermarriage in your family, Carl? That's what it was. There we go. 
We want to get close enough that I can hit him, but he can't hit me. We want to cheat. Cheese. No, this isn't cheating. This is cheesing. What about the random ones? Ah, oh, we don't want my blood pressure to go up. <laughs> okay, now pivot. Pivot, Todd. Oh, was there a lot of intermarriage in your family? Stupid. She, he doesn't even say Carl. He just says stupid and rude. Lovely, lovely, jubbly. And you want the wah! I still want my laughter track. Yes, we will save. I just want to make sure that we rough, rough, ruffle through the prison pockets first. Yes, ooh, kaboof! Uh, okay. I've always got to check that we don't accidentally load game. All right, we're numbering them, right? Making sure I'm still numbering all of our saves. Oh no, not another skeleton! I don't even have my weapon out! I don't have my boom bop bitty bop boop boop boop! I think I hit myself with that. Died our last hope for justice. Clothing skeletons have prison pockets. No, I suppose they don't. I suppose they don't. Who's Jennifer? Oh, is that? That's her name, isn't it? I was, I was like, why are we nagging this poor lady called Jennifer? What's she done to me? <laughs> poor Jennifer. I feel like you were taking a piss. Mm. <laughs> do you, David? Do you? <laughs> you drunk. <laughs> Thank you. I think she cares- I- no, I don't think she cares for Todd. I think she cares about the mission. Which is fucking rude. You know, Todd's a person too, Jennifer. That one! That one was a good one! Can I miss with these fire darts? Because I- you know, I don't wanna- oh dear. feel like him taking a piss. <laughs> That's more like David. <laughs> David, what have we told you? David, if you need a pee, go to the bathroom, all right? <laughs> Don't just go on the carpet, all right? <laughs> Shit, <me>. thank you. <laughs> David's like, my underwear feels warm for some reason. I don't know, <laughs> don't know why. I think... The most efficient way is to light heal and then maybe light heal again because it takes the longest to heal. And then if we, I can't camp because enemies are nearby. Okay, I'll save then. How am I making it sound like David? If you exclamation mark uh, TTS, it will take you to the like uh, the the it will also show you the, uh, the the service that I use to make it sound like David. Um, but we have a selection of premium TTS artisans, one of which is David. Uh, there's also GLaDOS on there. There's um, Linus Tech Tips. Linus Tech Tips. Well, um, I can't think of anyone else because David David occupies such a large part of my brain. Oh, um, Mr. M&M. &M, Mr. Slim Shady. <laughs> Todd is a person. How hard is that to understand? 
why he's called How Hard. Maida? That's Maida. Maida's used for um, special, special occasions, though. He's used for when we want to pray to our Lord and Savior, Sonic the Hedgehog. Jazzy Mocha, thank you so much for the follow. Thank you very much. Oh, somebody hit me. With you died our last hope. Just yeah, fucking found out who it was. Tharn is now free to do as he will. <laughs> it saddens me to see the beautiful land of Hemlock. I like how it takes within. so long to pivot. Goodbye. The, I the person who has hit me world. is a murder mystery. <laughs> that would call Sherlock Holmes. It takes so long to turn around that by the time I've turned around, I'm already dead. I looked away at the wrong time I did. All right, I see him, I see him. Oh my God, I got a critical strike. <laughs> Dab on those skeleton haters. I'm running out of numbers. Five, three, and nine hundred and nine are like that's all I can count to. Oh, four twenty, I know that number. I'd like to maybe heal so that I could get my uh get my mana back. Must be another skeleton. I said, uh, Vader, I thought she looked like one of those, um, you know, with the, with the floated cloth. I think it looks like one of those inflatable, uh, inflatable boys that you get at gas stations. Oh, camp enemy? How close do the enemies need to be? She's a sorceress. She really likes sauce. She's big into ketchup. <gasps> I gained a level! Why? From opening doors? I only got four points this time, but we're not going to reload because I think four is still, you know, four is still positive. So where do we want to put our four points? I feel like into strength is a good one. Maybe? Maybe not. It does give me more health, uh, more, less fatigue. Less fatigue. Our last big savings <laughs> Maybe we put a little bit into intelligence because Todd is very smart. The game design lexicon. Thank you so much for the problem. Welcome in, lexicon. That game has a very unique setting. The Skyrim Special Edition. Where do you lads think the next um, the next Elder Scrolls is going to be based? We were doing a quiz and um one of the questions was which of these um which of these elder scrolls regions has there never been an elder scrolls game and i i didn't i didn't buzz in on time but i know the true answer that that i i think uh, one of my friends said like oh with one of the areas of the map one of like uh, the the argonian level uh, the argonian area of the map but i know that arena and daggerfall they took place all across the map, so that I was like, "Excuse me, that was a wrong answer." Mm -hmm. um, agility, or yeah, I think we could. Excuse me, actually, the first Elder Scrolls game takes a place. Uh, takes a place everywhere on the map, not in one particular region. <laughs> Radiator Springs. <gasps> there are some enemies nearby. For if these fucking skeletons have re bloody spawned, I didn't win the I, I I I actually came plum last. <laughs> I I I very much lost the quiz. Are 
we had a we had a round on um Civ music and I didn't do super well in the Civ music round because I keep I, whenever I play Civ, I uh, keep my music off. Because otherwise, otherwise it gets just it ends up getting really repetitive. <gasps> oh lads, you're gonna be very proud of me. I I won a game of Civ. I won I won a game of Civ. Yeah, yeah. It's gonna be in Skyrim, Skyrim 2. <laughs> Todd just can't stop making you buy Skyrim. <laughs> That's Smithy, thank you so much for the follow. Yeah, Greg, yeah, against Greg. Not against the PC. No. I won. I won, I won, I won. And moreover, I had three um three victory chances as well. Like, uh, I nearly won on culture. I did win. On, no, I did win on culture. I nearly won on science and, uh, oh lord, Jesus. Oh, stab him, please. I think we're dead. You can punch a child to save their life. Oh, he didn't. Okay. When you died, our last hope for justice. Sorry punch a child to save their life, but there would be a clip of you punching a child on social media forever. Would you suffer public embarrassment to save a child? Goodbye. I wish can I get a bit more like background on the child like what is the child dying of yeah I've got a sock wrapped around at the moment okay because I don't I don't have any like bandages or anything and I'm trying to stop myself from bonking it or anything how does this compare to croc somehow more tolerable than croc <laughs> somehow less tanky Tamriel is oblivion Good. Last hope gone again. Better resurrect him. All right, Todd, let's go. I think we may as well just go in the water. There was gobos in it. Rock's literally called Legend of the Gobos. Gobos, gobos. Yeah, with a gamer injury too. Yeah. My uh, my trick was not trying to win. Oh, he's not he's not coming over here. Maybe we can like step towards him. He gets confused. I don't know what that fucking noise is. Would you rather be socially embarrassed or die? Well, is somebody else dying? That's why I need a little bit of a I need a little bit of a background. Like, is this kid a nice person as well? How old is the kid, you know? What's gonna kill the kid? Am I related to the kid in any way? Or is this just a rant? Yeah, how hard is the punch? <laughs> how hard is the punch? Am I getting arrested? Because that sounds like some like sounds like something that's gonna get me arrested. You would punch the kid? <laughs> Just for fun or for <laughs> save their life. <laughs> Can we get a run up? Is kicking an option? Oh, we did it. It didn't sound like I was hitting him, but apparently I was. The kid would back me up, but what if they're like three? They didn't, they wouldn't know. Yeah, how hard would you punch the kid? <laughs> Like there's, you know, there's a, there's a lot of extenuating circumstances that I'd like to know before I, you know, before I committed to punching the child. Cause you gotta think, I'd probably, I'd probably lose my job over that as well. <laughs> I guess it would depend, actually. <laughs> Would you guys believe me if I was like, now nah, lads, like, I had to, <laughs> to punch that kid. <laughs> I had to punch, would you believe me? <laughs> 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 do you guys believe me if I was like, yeah, I had to do it. Uh, 
I think Ronald McDonald would sponsor me after I, uh, if I, if there was a, if there was a, a video of me punching a child on the internet. I'm not sure that would do so good for my, um, my brand, you know? Oh no! With you died our last hope for justice. Right, well, I know there's nothing up here now. <laughs> Suddenly I died. What are they able to say? Cool. Would I punch a child to save that child's life? Signs point to yes. I just, it would really depend how hard I was punching. You know, like, am I, is it just like a, yeah, you know? Hope you don't die, bucko, kind of thing. Because I feel like I could, you know, you could get away with like, you no, know, kind of like a like a little like a yeah, like a jovial punch. But if it was like straight square in the middle of you know full force right in the middle of the face, I just feel like I I feel like it would be ruining your life to say theirs, which might be a little bit you know. I maybe I'm looking too hot too uh, too far into this. With you died our last home for justice. <laughs> our last hope for justice has died too, Todd. Todd, no! <laughs> Thank you, Shipman. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, we want to go down, I think. Oh, the harder the punch, the more effective the saving. I'd softly, I'd you know, do a soft, jovial punch. And at least then they got a chance, you know? A t attack. And then they, they, I'm at least giving them a chance, you know? I'm being, I'm being, being nice, but I'm not. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not punching a child particularly hard, you know? And like, does the child know I'm saving them? Oh, I gained a level, lovely. Or does the child just think I'm punching them, you know? Oh, I got five points this time. Oh, I must. Uh, let's go up in strength and then one in infinity. So we thought about two into agility. Let's go with agility. And like, is the child outside or am I going into a hospital seeking out a child and then punching them? Because that would look worse as well. I think I, just overall, I think I'd feel a bit mean, you know? Oh, wonder why. Come on, Todd. Come on! I can hear some large naked men up ahead. They groan. The large naked men do groan. Um, right, Todd levels up. Okay. Right, new area at least. I hate how they groan, it's really weird. It's really it's slightly disturbing. It kind of sounds- Oh, there he is, naked man! Oh, I hate how he groans after you, I hate that! You it literally sounds like someone's, like, recorded outside of their roommate's room while they had, like, they had a, a special friend over. And then kind of, you know, changed it so it sounded a bit more like a- What are they, what are they? like, the zombies? <laughs> yeah, it does. With you I didn't even see my assailant. I presume it's the same large naked man that killed me last time. You know, I'm gonna say no. I'm just gonna say no. I wouldn't. I wouldn't punch a child. Oh dear. 
feel like that's the safest. I would. I'm getting ready to jump. With you died our I'm sick of seeing that lady's face. <laughs> the kid who never got punched travels through time and hunts you down. Feels like a chance not worth taking. But he's already dead. Is he gonna travel in time? Mr. Oh, fucking Tan. hell! Jesus Tan. Christ! <gasps> Tan! I thought you were stronger than this. Uh. With you died our last hope for justice. Lord is now life. free to do as he will. It saddens me to see the beautiful land of Tamriel rotting from within. Goodbye. Tad, I wish you peace in the afterworld. <laughs> I think we're just gonna have to run through it. Oh. He died. Oh, we died. With you died our last hope. Oh, oh this lady! Ma'am! Okay, thank you so much. Thank you. It was such an offensive beginning of like, Dad! <laughs> I thought Eminem was taking his break again. I think we're just gonna have to go full speed into the naked men. Hey, kid. Good morning. I got a critical With strike you on him. Died our last hope for With you died our last hope. That lady has to be a redeem. Redeem. I loaded the wrong bloody thing. Schools can paralyze you too. We haven't had the chance to see that. I don't think it. I don't think they need to, judging by how quickly they can kill me. By the time Todd raises his fucking stick, that guy is already. With you died. If you died, our last hope. Going in. I'm going in. Charge, Todd, charge. I was like, charge? Charge for what? Another or copy of Skyrim? With you died, our last hope for justice. Maybe we have to kite the naked men. You know, we attract them. Todd does a little dance to attract the naked moaning men. And then we kite them out. Like, ooh, large naked man! Ooh, yeah, follow me over here, naked man! Oh dear, naked man! Follow me over there! I mean, it fucking worked. It fucking worked. I don't hear a single thing. That worked. That, that bloody worked. Ah, oh, naked man! Into the water, Todd! They're like bees! Naked man won't follow you into the water. All right. I mean, it did work. There's another naked man up there, and he we hit me. We do died our last hope for justice. Thorn is now free to do as he will. I saw his feet it's as I died. To see the beautiful land of Tamriel rotting from within. The long pole to fight the naked men intentional is all we got. In he's all we got other than using our fists. Do you reckon fists are more effective against naked men, or do you think the pole is? We could try our fists. We'll try our fists. Why not put the staff down? Unequip staff. Maybe we need to be naked as well. Like we disrobe. Use fire? I don't really have enough mana to do it. And I can't go to sleep because, um,. There's the enemies nearby, right? <laughs> okay, fists. You died our last hope for justice. 
<laughs> not super, not super good, not super effective. It saddens me to see the beautiful land of Tamriel rotting from within. Goodbye. I wish you peace in the afterworld. I think we've just got, I think the kiting thing worked the best. I think luring the naked man out. Oh dear. And I think what we've got to do is we've got to reverse into the naked man so that we don't need to turn around. Reverse, reverse. Okay, I've, I've found him. The naked man has been attracted. He's hit me. It's all right, it's all right, lads. It's all right. All right, go back. We went the wrong way. Lads, there's another man and he is nude as well. No! With you, die. Okay, the reversing worked. We just gotta make sure we go the correct way, all right? We back into the naked man. And then we we loop him. We go back down the corridor. We don't run into the other naked man and then we jump in the water, okay? One man at a time. Right. Reverse. Odd. Hear him moaning. Oh, he's there! He's there! He's there! We attracted him. We didn't even reverse correctly, but it's fine. We attracted him nonetheless. Oh god, he's murdering me. It's fine. It's fine. To the water, Todd. To the water, Todd! Good job, Todd! Yeah, Todd! Right now, Todd. Um, This is important that we don't just go find another nude gentleman and immediately die. Right, Todd? This looks pretty safe. This looks safe, Todd. Yeah. Good job, Todd. Good job. There is another naked enemy. Why are you all nude? All right, then. All right. Now, it would be good if we could heal. We could jump, Todd. You could jump with the J key. That would be great. Maybe we're overdressed. I did think about taking Todd's armor off. There we go. Now pivot, and then we're going to heal. And I bet it's going to be like, you can't heal. There are enemies nearby. <gasps> absolutely blessed we're blessed we're blessed we avoided the naked men we healed they do look like godzilla you're right it's interesting it's like the trolley problem it's like the trolley problem right you gotta decide where your morality lies on you know if you if if you if you would want to punch a child or not you know <laughs> i'd say no i think i think no you know overall on balance probably would go in there right we're at the bot we've made it to the bottom of the map Tropical. Yeah, which trolley? Which trolley are you gonna take? The one with the with the funny wheel that doesn't go straight. The one with a bit of gum stuck at the bottom. The one with a sticky handle. Oh, I hear some fucking something. What is that? Is that a spider? Why is I? Two spiders, double spider. Oh, with double hits! Oh my god, I have spiders. With you died our last hope for justice. Tharn is now free. Why are the spiders so, uh, the spider's so fucking strong?
Why are they so strong? We've been playing for three hours, lads. We've been playing for three hours. Three hours and Todd is still stuck here. Todd is still trapped. Get good, Todd. I'd like to play Morrowind. I'd like to. So I, I had a dream. No promises, just a dream, you know? I know they say don't let your dreams be beans, but... That we take Todd all the way to the new Elder Scrolls game. We 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 play as Todd and we go we go through oh fuck. we go through <laughs> Look at those little teeth. Do you see a teeth? Um <laughs> it broke again. Um I'd like to like to take take Todd and play the new Elder Scrolls game when it comes. All the way from Arena to Redfall. He's he is fucking he is. Now I've got to wait for wait for Elder Scrolls to realize that it's crashed and decide I can play it again. It's a hard dungeon. I forgot about the easier ones outside the city. Should I have maybe trained for this? Should I have like done something before? I feel like I feel like too I'm too weedy for this. Okay, it's thinking about loading back up. Are we gonna run the same like the same gamba lads? If the save is broken, we play we play cars. <laughs> if our save is broken, we load up cars. Yeah, all right. If our save is corrupt, we will play. Right, what well, where where will we save? Todd is helping. Ah, this is fine. It's fine. You think I'm too low level? Am I too much of a too much of a weenie? <laughs> you escape cars yet again. I can hear moaning. Hear moaning naked men again. Right, so we're at the bottom. Go left or right. I think we just I think we're gonna say yeah, this is the edge, this is the bottom. Those spiders are over here. No. Spiders. I think I want to go the other direction. I think I want to explore fully over here. When can life be a highway? It's a question I ask myself all too often. Right, spiders up there. I like that I can open my map. So do we think there's... I don't reckon there's anything over here. I don't think... I bet there's nothing. So let's keep on swimming. Just keep swimming. I can still hear him. More spiders now. Or possibly same spiders. What we got? Yeah, it's just one room. I kind of doubt. That takes us back up here. Luckily, we're playing as an Argonian, so we can spend as much time in the water as we like. Maybe I should have found some more <laughs> powerful weapons, eh? I'm hoping that fire kills them in one. Maybe that's a little bit too, uh... You know, like, spiders don't like fire, right? 
He's definitely hitting them. God, these things are beefcakes. Why are they not fucking dead? Bloody beefcakes. Be able to hit them from here. Need longer stick. Need a fucking newspaper to kill these spiders. Or a shoe. There we go. We got it. I think they should ooze like green or something like real spiders. Why have they got such a high defense? How do you know what real spiders ooze? You never squashed a spider before? You guys don't act like bloody saints now. I know we've all squashed a spider or two in our lives. I never kill spiders, Badger. I, pre I prefer to put them outside. Or leave them be because they do catch the, like, the other creepy crawlies. You know, I prefer, but sometimes. Sometimes, you know, there are, there are spiders that I just can't abide by. And sometimes it happens by accident. You're trying to catch them, your hand slips and... Um... I raise them, teach them algebra, and send them off to college. So they become web developers. <laughs> <laughs> we have lethal venomous spiders. We gotta kill them. The kill or be killed world. <laughs> squash or be squashed, eh? And some spiders are just assholes, right? My sister, I remember I was staying around hers and she put her she put her pajama shirt on and there was a spider in the pajama shirt. Never forgiven them since then. Terrorizing my sister. So, you know, she had like she she reaches down to see what that like tickling sensation in her back was and pulled out this big spider like bit uh, like a large spider like fist sized spider yeah big em. and i just i just feel like those kinds of spiders are mean you know like my poor innocent sister just trying to get ready for bed I don't need this journal up right now. I am just trying. Um, yep, thank you. Light heal. I think there was another rock, wasn't there? Yeah, I see him. Thirty-five gold pieces. Wow. All right. I'm gonna save as well. I feel like Todd becomes the beast it works fine. There we go, nice. The point of the journal anyway. I don't remember how did it was it this? So at the twenty first of Rain's hand in the year three E three eight nine, the ruler of Rehad has marked Stonekeep on your map, the province of Hammerfell. I can print it. 
I can send this to a pr I can print this? What, so I can put it up on my wall? I don't own a printer. Who owns a printer? Guy's gonna be like, Badger, I own a printer. Why it always really annoys me when, like, like things say that you need to print them out. I don't own a printer. I don't have a printer. I do, but I've only used it as a scanner. I feel like, you know, pr printers are like air fryers. What the fuck was that noise? Aren't printers just ways to sell printer ink? I own four printers. How much does the ink cost you on them, Rayman? Keep those four. Oh, jeez. Cried from 2 a.m. to 8 a.m. when my uncle woke up and could kill it. Why didn't you, like, make a noise, Brad? Why didn't you go, excuse me, Mama Ma and Papa, would you please kill the spider in my room? I would just use the school's printer and then the office's printer. I remember there being, like, a, a thing in the office that I used to work at that you were not allowed to use the office printer for non-office printing. $60 a month. I knew it. They're scamming you, Rain Man. They're scamming you. You know, when the printer, printer ink thing, thing in, pr the printer ink thing says it's empty. It's not really empty. It's lying. There's still printer ink in there. It just won't give it to you. It's lying to sell you more printer ink. Sorry, I'm just putting on my foot warmer. My feet are too cold. But I'm trying to do it without picking it up. I'm just trying to Printers are a scam. AKA slippers. No, 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 it's a foot warmer. It's a foot, it's an electric foot warmer. Slippers don't do the job. I find that I just end up being cold in slippers. You know, like my foot has more layers on it, but it's still fucking freezing cold. So, uh, corporations are gonna cut out my mic. I know. Amazon's gonna be like, excuse me, Badger. We sell a lot of printer ink. What if the printer ink companies offer to sponsor me? Which company? Which one? Which one am I? Which one? Fax machines are not a scam. Fax machines are cool. How cold is it in the UK? Well, I mean, I'm, I'm a pretty cold person, so... I feel fucking freezing. <laughs> I'm fucking freezing! I feel like I'm covered in snow. Um... Todd is healthy. Todd kills spiders. Todd becomes the beast. I think that's where we were. Todd? Todd, could you just... So the UK... The UK's alright, um... When it comes to insulation. We actually have... Or in general, but we have too much insula... We have insulation that is almost too much because now... Our summers are becoming so hot, um, and we don't have aircon. We have these really well insulated houses, because obviously we were so used to it being cold, um, that it means that now it gets way too hot in the summer, and there's no way of extracting said heat. Yeah, we're poorly equipped for the climate of And it's like, you know, if it snows, everything just shuts down because we're not really prepared for snow. All right, what we got in here? We could take a nap. Oh dear. With you died our last hope for justice. <sighs> but like I, like yesterday I did solve the climate apocalypse. We just need a we need a freeze pee. And then put it in the North Pole is the TLDR with it. I used to work at a big box computer store. Guy bought a printer. Asked, I asked if he wanted extra cartridges of ink because they, oh, they only came with half a cart. Why they would they only come with half a cart? But the prices of printers these days, I'll just buy a new printer when it runs out of ink. Was it more effective? I suppose, you know, because printers break as well. Yeah, we just need to make Pittsburghs. Exactly. We were going to call them the golden, golden arches spread. You know, 
I always wondered why, you know, oh no, that's stupid. I was gonna say, I, I wondered why tarmac, we didn't make kind of white tarmac, but then the glare would be so much that drivers probably couldn't see. So that was a, I was, I was about to make a, a silly suggestion. Yeah, blinding. Not that my other, you know, my other suggestions such as Pittsburgh, yeah, they're, they're pretty good. But um, the blinding tarmac is not my best. Probably too expensive to color it white, eh? I won't say. What's the Pittsburgh again? So I said that we were wasting he. That, you know, what we if I was supreme leader of the world, I would get everybody to take one cup of ocean water into their home, thus reducing the height of sea level. That's lowering sea level rise. With you die. And then, and then I would also start harvesting people's pee so it doesn't go back into the atmosphere. And we'd freeze it and make piss glaciers. Thus creating more cold and also reducing the amount of water that's in the cycle. Mm -hmm. And it could double up as a tourist attraction with station bear grills there. Todd takes a nap, Todd becomes beast. So I would be increasing the tourism trade of Antarctica too. I really think about it, it's a good idea. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Get a government to sustain that. <laughs> yeah, so there might be a little bit of a trouble with the environment with how much pee is going to be in the in the sea. The amount of bare grills. But I figure if it stays frozen, then it's not going to be a problem. The only problem is, is if it melts. I don't reckon I'm going to be able to take a nap here, but we can try. Yeah, enemies. Yeah, pee's already in the sea. I don't know. Hasn't it become illegal in Australia to pee in the sea? Is it Australia? Which, you know, is, is understandable naked men! Kite the naked man. Kite the naked man. No, to pee in the sea, wrong. I'm stuck. Oh, I, I've become one with the naked man. I think we have clipped through one another. Oh. With you died our last hope How would they know? I don't know how they know. I don't know. Like, maybe if you haven't drinking enough water, there's like a yellow halo around you. I don't know. I don't know. I thought it'd become illegal to pee in the sea. That's just a, a little bit of a break from Elder Scrolls. A little bit of a moment to myself. Uh, illegal to pee in the ocean. It is illegal to urinate in the sea in Portugal, not Australia. And a Spanish resort has also banned peeing in the sea. Hear this. The news that Vigo, a beach resort in northwestern Spain, has banned peeing in the sea has sent shockwaves through the UK. That's a news article. Shockwaves! The people of the UK are so angry. They're so angry that they need to, they can't pee in the sea. <laughs> T 
told his large naked men should be a puppet. <laughs> oh dear. What would their first song be? Oh, I clicked on it just automatic. Oh, don't worry. I clicked in the game. It's okay. I think Todd Becomes the Beast should be a uh, a pop band. Looks like it was the Eye newspaper. Yeah. No, the Spanish Sea. The one they were mad about was Spain. Like, I get it. It's kind of gross. If you're thinking, you know, imagine... Um, Imagine you're on holiday, you're swimming in the sea, and then... Uh, Bob, from the resort, just starts pissing right next to you. That's kind of gross, right? What is... what are you doing? I could just say, ha! Wait, look at those teeth! Look at that... look at that little... little goblin! Maybe yawning, yeah. Or having zoomies. Fucking gobbo. <laughs> you doing gobbo? I don't have any snacks for you. You did. Oh, it sounds out. I can't show you guys because she's not gonna come over here unless I got snacks. She, uh, she, it's like her, her, how she gets me to give her snacks is refusing to come over unless I've got the snacks. <laughs> Knob and tossets. It's exactly how English people talk. Yeah, I suppose, you know, I suppose the pea, the pea bleaches coral, maybe? I don't know. Oh, geez. I think it. I think it's paralyzed me. No, I don't know. I'm stuck. Oh god, Todd, run! Todd, run! Todd, for the love of all, all of the mums, just fucking run, Todd, run! There's I'm being surrounded. With you died our last hope for justice. What if only British people? It's what is our diet? Oh yeah, since I missed it. Yeah. Well, what's up, Red? What's up? I did run out of cookie. We've double cookie today. We had, uh, you missed a good one though. We had, you will win the lottery very soon. And then we had, there is a th prospect of a thrilling time ahead for you. Does that mean everyone in Portugal uses a Mac because they can't pee in the sea? Oh my God, because it's pizza. Is that one of your own, Sprint? Is that one of your own? this controlled by mouse or does it have keyboard controls thank god it has keyboard controls thank you <laughs> thank god sweet lord sonic it does have keyboard controls it's got um uh directional key controls and you can there are some hotkeys but they're not very intuitive but the fighting is um mouse controls so that this is Why Brits are so pasty. <laughs> to give the baby or oh, what well, soothes. Doesn't deserve a cookie today. The naughty. It just works. Is this the starter dungeon? No, the one after the starter st starter dungeon. So not the not quite the tutorial dungeon. Light heal. Heal yourself, Todd. And then run. And then turn and fight. Stand and fight, Todd. Stand and fight. Go back. Todd, fight. Todd, attack! With you died our last hope for justice. Tharn is now free to do as he wills. It saddens me to see the beautiful...
peed on my rug today. <laughs> That's why she's not an angel. Starting to think there's no hope for justice. This is better than Croc. I, you know, I'm starting to want to retract my. Uh, you know, I said it was less tanky. I don't know. Maybe if we camp here, is there anywhere like to? Hey, Grom. Good morning. I'd like to camp. Is there anywhere to? All right. Okay. There are. I'm hoping that maybe the spiders may have gone away. Oh, there's spiders everywhere. Well, you know, I did pick a bit of a wizard class as well, you know? I thought, oh my god. thought that I'd be okay being a wizard. You know, at least I've got a heal. Rum, it's awful. It's awful we're being assailed by spiders constantly. Alright, the spiders, the spider's trapped. The spider is trapped. I think, there we go. We got him up against a wall. Uh, cause the spider dart spell uses a lot of my mana and I used it three times on a spider and the spider still didn't die. So. The spider's more afraid of you than you are of it. Like, why are these spiders such damage spun- um, damage sponsors? Spun- sponges. Offer a cupcake? Best I can do is a copy of Skyrim. Oh, I think I saved. Odd hills. <laughs> Seems to have a bit of an ineffective skill and weapon combination. You know, but Todd persists, right? Todd is persistent. Todd is a highly intelligent individual. Todd will get you to buy that copy of Skyrim again. grit and determination you know much like Todd did when he started at Bethesda I mean not that this Todd has anything to do with any real Todd's dead or alive but you know Todd had to make his own way in the world right a swing and a poke attack depending on where you hold the mouse yeah so um you can if you depending on where you move the mouse not even necessarily hold the mouse Todd will swing this way this way this way this way or this way Do I have the cure disease? No. But I'm healthy, it's alright. We're good. Right. We're going to the left now. I don't mean to yawn. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> George, God, you got me yawning! I'm 
down and then left, I guess? Still not on mobile. You sure it's not on mobile? I thought it would be on mobile. We went the wrong way. How do I feel like the game is holding up for a 29 year old game? Honestly, like, not too bad. I mean, oh, I mean, it doesn't look great, does it? I mean, you know, like, if you compare it to a game today, there's obviously a big difference. I can hear the scaly bobs behind hey me. Hey there. Oh, I am Todd How something, please. Consider purchasing another copy of Scarum. The year is 2081. And we just can't do any better than the old. In the O? David, did you get tired halfway through? David, we can't get better than the O. Alright, alright, David. <laughs> Thank you, drunk. <laughs> Thank you. David had to cut himself off because he was so eager to buy that copy of Skyrim that he had to walk away. I'm getting double teamed by some spiders. With you died our last hope for justice. Tharn is now free to do as he wills. It saddens me to see the beautiful land of Tamriel rotting from within. Goodbye. I wish you peace in the afterworld. Heart attack. Tragic. We're gonna feel really bad if we predict David's death. Died because you wouldn't buy another copy of Skyrim. I don't even own one copy. Franco owns a copy of Uh I don't think I own a copy anyway. Hang on. No, Greg owns a copy, I don't. Me neither, same. Don't let Todd know that. I don't own a copy either. You guys are <laughs> like actually matter. Actually, I don't own one either. Hang on. Do we want to, uh, let's do a poll, shall we? New poll. You do own two Skyrims. Greg owns uh, the Elder Scrolls V Skyrim and the Elder Scrolls V Skyrim Special Edition. I own Crocs, but not Skyrim. Are they, uh, are they the Lightning McQueen's... <laughs> Lightning, Lightning McQueen Croc? At the PlayStation 4 Special Edition. Gonna look, you buy an Indertoad? Right, lads. I'll put a, put a poll up. Do you own a copy of Skyrim? I'm a vote, I'm a vote in there as well. I write sins but not tragedies. When's Skyrim 6 coming out? I'm gonna look, I'm gonna Google it. I feel like we just need a like a little little breather in between um arena. <laughs> so Elder Scrolls 6. Blah, 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 blah. Sometime after Starfield, which is releasing in September. Uh, 6th of September, Starfield's coming out. It's Todd Howard, don't know who that is, has described the sequel being in pre-production back in June 2022. So... Todd Howard himself introduced the Elder Scrolls 6 teaser trailer in 2018. What's the point of giving a teaser trailer in 2018 and then not starting pre-production until 2022 till four years later? What's the, what's the point? Right? Why, why, I guess maybe COVID um, delayed it? Maybe they were planning on doing pre-production start it. You know, maybe COVID delayed it. You know, I don't want to, you don't want to neg Todd. They're getting people ready, but like, it's too, it's too early, right? 
Because we know what happens when you, you hype people up too much for a game. You get, you know. <laughs> Got distracted by my mom in 2020. Yeah, yeah, I see that. That was a good year for her. Probably wanted people to stop asking if it was Skyrim. <laughs> That's true. They noticed they could sell Skyrim. Oh, no, you're right. I bet they thought right. If we get people excited for Elder Scrolls. We get ex we get excited for Elder Scrolls. We'll buy Skyrim again, right? Because we can't buy the new Elder Scrolls. We'll just buy the old one again. Because I want to prepare for the new one coming up. Oh yes, they told us to hand over a bit more cash as well. I own enough copies for Skyrim for the whole chat. On and one over then, bread and one over. Right. Um. Todd kills spiders, or do we just get to Todd kills? Maybe just Todd kills. There's a new Elder Scrolls amiibo coming out. Now buy Skyrim again. Which direction do we want to go? Either or left, I suppose, though. Xbox 360, Xbox One, PC, VR, Switch. Oh, I'll take a Switch one, please. No, no, actually, I'd rather take a PC. Can I, can, can I... Can I trade that in? I, I actually want a PC one. Oh, hey, naked man. I bet it I bet it runs nicer on PC than it does on it doesn't switch. Oh I I did it! I did it, lads! Did you just see me juke that naked man? Wow, that was pretty good. And now we're in like some kind of Now we're in some kind of, like, vault, which might be where we've got to go. Right, yeah, we save. We left that naked man out in the cold. We can just... <laughs> oh, dear. And Tears of the Kingdom. When's Tears of the Kingdom? Isn't it, like, less than 30 days now? What are you trying to do in this game? We are finding a thing. That's going to help the queen translate the thing that we need her to translate. Hey, Grum, I'll see you later. You have a good stream. You have a good day. Have a lovely Tuesday. Wait, wait, wait we're just trying to find a thing. <laughs> it's, uh, it's not super clear to me either. Oh, we found Mark! We found Mark. Mark, what are you doing in the chest? Sage. We can use him. This is Todd How Something again. Would you died our last hope for more Skyrim sales. Bethesda is now free to do as they will. It <gasps> saddens me to see the beautiful copies of Skyrim rotting on shelves. Goodbye and I wish you peace in the afterworld. Dot, and why not buy Skyrim again in the afterlife? <laughs> yeah, you know what? In your will, leave a copy of Skyrim. I guess, no, actually, in your will, you should say to burn your copy of Skyrim to take one out of the, like, the, out of circulation so more people will buy Skyrim. You don't want to gift your Skyrim to any of your relatives because then they won't buy their own Skyrim. Mm. Right, you're right. Nearly, nearly lost Todd some money there. Thank you, RK. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. Let's have a little peep around this room first before we... My armor value seem really low. Oh, new place though. I had plus five before, but I don't know what happened. <laughs> Honestly, don't know. Oh. oh! Was I not wearing half of my cloak? Why does the number go down the more clothes I put on? Lower is better. Oh, right. Right, okay. Why? Why is lower better? Hmm. 
Maybe, you know, maybe the naked men also got confused by that and that's why they're not wearing it. Yeah, that's why they're not wearing any clothes. Exactly why they're not wearing any clothes. I think I'm going to stick with my staff. I'm really enjoying the staff. Is it like, you know, they get plus three hit thing? Plus three hit points. All right, I guess we go through the through the door. I like these tapestries of eyes bleeding. Very nice. Ah, gobos! Gobos! Gobo! Kill the fucking gobo! More gobos! Goblin, nothing usable. I've seen another goblin, but I don't. When it says you've seen a goblin, I think it just means I like I've seen a dead goblin. I don't think it means that I actually see a, 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 a got a. <laughs> Naked from the waist down, it emphasizes his nudity. <laughs> Donald Duck or Winnie the Pooh, who's our favorite Disney nudist. can take a nap take a nap at least mickey mouse is wearing gloves he's also got trousers on most importantly shorts hey there a gobbo oh there he is another one <laughs> got them both the one hitter there's another go there's another go fucking gobbo i can hear them you know, I'm a little bit sad that there's not more goblins, actually. So, obviously, I'm I'm pleased that there isn't such a large amount that I don't, you know, I'm swamped with goblins. But I heard this was like the goblin, the, the goblin place, or the goblin keep, you know, that they were having a big problem with goblins. And, you know, I've had more of a problem with naked men than anything. David Bowie might be around. <laughs> I don't want to go to sleep, so anyways. More of you don't own, don't own Skyrim than do own Skyrim. Todd is crying right now. Todd can barely see to attack these goblins through his fucking tears, lads. Get out there and buy Skyrim. Everybody who already owns Skyrim, get out there and buy Skyrim! <laughs> Again! Never seen Labyrinth? It's not that good. I watched it um, fairly recently. And I, w I just wasn't, I wasn't a big fan, you know? I thought it was okay. I didn't like the music. Yeah, David's package, magnificent. Absolutely magnificent. Best part of the movie. But like, kind of, otherwise I felt like I could leave it, you know? Tell them I'm disappointed whether they don't own Skyrim. Is the missus actually secretly taught? <laughs> is that why you've got so many copies? <laughs> Will you be also buying Skyrim's copies to compliment Greg's Skyrim copies? My 
even wanting to go. I almost want to look at it. Oh! Uh. too bad oh the amount the like how tense i am is not really reflected by how epic the battles are like they don't the, i don't feel like they oh i can hear something you know like i'm fighting for my life here and the battles just slowly i made a crossroads deal with todd howard Free Skyrim copies for free advertising. I think it's an orc I can... Oh dear. Oh, there's three of them. I'm a little bit worried. Oh, that was close. The Three points isn't really good enough, but I'm not willing to reload. I don't care. I don't. I don't. I don't want to reload. So uh, we are going to up agility by two. I don't know. It's better to reload and reroll, but I'm not. not. And I'm gonna up strength as well. I just want to be strong. Todd kills, changed armor, five. So let's um, save that as six. Let's see if they've got anything on them. A, po a potion. It's a fucking potion. We have never seen one of those in our life before. How do I use a potion? Is it this? Unidentified potion. Should I just take it and do those? I saved. Yeah, why would they be carrying poison on them though? Item cannot be equipped. Can I? Well, can I use it? I've got a weight limit on my inventory. How to drink them? There's someone in here with me. Maybe not. Maybe the door just shut behind me. Da -da. Knew there was gonna be enemies. But I think we now got enough to... Oh, there's a man! God! Fucking man, fuck off! If you're not naked, you don't belong in this bloody keep anyway. These men, they come in here. I don't care. I don't care if it'll encumber me. I don't bloody care. These men, they come in and they're overdressed. Oh, party of men. Don't they know this is the nudist colony? Get out of here. There are enemies nearby. More fucking clothed men. Oh, clothed elderly man. Get out of here. Either take off the clothes. Or go somewhere else. Who do they think they are? Where are they even gone? They, they left. Quickly as they came. Don't want to see old man body. Like you might be very, you might be very sexy underneath. You never know. Oh, stop oh. hitting me. <laughs> you might look like David Attenborough underneath. Drunk. Thank you very much. Thank you. 
Lovely. Oh, no, there are enemies nearby as well. I was trying to um, get more mana. And shoes and socks, thank you very much for the follow. Thank you very much. More clothes, men, get out of here. Happy Superman Day, everyone. Here's to the next 85 years of truth, justice, and the hope of tomorrow. Thank you very much, Alien. Thank you so much. Very much happy Superman Day to you as well. 44 gold pieces. Maybe we should save. I wonder if we've ever seen David Attenborough nude. Probably not. At least I haven't seen that documentary. Right, let's try and, uh, ew. Enemies nearby, great. Oh, there we go. This is what I'm talking about. Naked enemies. Now those horrible clothed ones. To until fully healed. I am healed. Lovely, lovely, jubbly lads. This went well. It's June 12th. That was close enough, right? Or is Superman Day different from Superman Anniversary? I've thought about getting some of the Buffy comics. I'm not a big cop uh, comic um, comic reader. Um, I haven't read many graphic novels either. Where are we? Do you mind? Do you, I'm just gonna look at my crystal ball for a just a moment. Just a moment. Um, and where are we, Stone Keep? Don't don't mind me. I'm just looking at a uh, at my crystal ball. Find the scroll that will lead you to Fangware. Oh yeah, we we go. We're trying to get to Fangware. Go ahead, straight ahead from the entrance. Turn right once you reach the throne. Go through the door and kill the first group of enemies. Lads, it was really lads. It, it, literally all I had to do was enter, turn right, and grab. We, we we entered and we turned left. And obviously now we've gone on to this big, you know, big, big journey. I actually just had to, had to go in and turn another direction. So, to find the scroll, you simply go straight ahead from the entrance, turn right once, once you reach the throne. Go to the door and kill the first group of enemies, usually wolves. Now go to the very end of the room, open the door to the right. You should see a raised blue platform. Get on it, jump across the ledge, turn right, kill the skeletons. Oh, before going across the water to reach the island guarded by a large group of ghouls. Alright, alright, it's a little bit, a little bit more complicated than that, for sure. Sure, 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 As sure, a renowned sure. naturalist. If grown, used if. to the gratuitous nudity of the natural world. I bet you have, David. I bet you have. I bet you... In this dark, oh. foreboding dungeon. <coughs> Thank you. David never finishes a thought of Attenborough. Too dark for him to read it. He was like, no, I can't. I, you know, I can't be talking about hunky lizard men. I can't. It's just, it's, it's too much. It's like a window into his soul. <laughs> he refused to call them hunky. He's like, I ain't no scaly. I ain't no fucking scaly and you're not going to make me one. Right, I'll take folks. us the right way. I'll rejoin you tomorrow night for murder, mystery, Ooh. drugs, hallucinations, dapper mustaches, top hats, and one of the original promises, Kvitsaluk Sleeper. Drug, thank you very I am much! I for my presentation, the hunkiest chatter on Twitch Pride Rise. 
Who? Who's the who? Who's 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 that? I <laughs> Greg, did you put? Did you did you send that message? I have a <gasps> talking about fucking hunky. Hello, beast men. Do you think they'll mind me just squeezing past? Let me squeeze past beast men. Oh Jesus Christ! No. Oh no. Drunk, I will see you later as well. I didn't say I'll see you later, but I will see you later. And Brooks, thank you very much. Thank you. I hope you had was your meeting nice? Or well, the presentation nice? Did we you do well? Did they boo? Did they throw tomatoes? I was on six. And then I think I, I stopped to heal. There was no squeezing. And if I just squeeze past. Oh, fucking spiders. Might be alright if we just hide around the corner. Looks like I could have killed them if I tried, you think? I'm not sure. Are they dead? He hasn't got anything left. Did it? Everyone said they were very impressed by the amount of work I presented. Oh, so quantity over quality. I see. I see. Sorry, just thinking of those hunky naked lizard men got me distracted. I'm not a skelly though, or a furry for that matter. No. No, no, no. Of course not. Of course not. Oh dear. Not a scaly or a furry, I promise, I swear. Just, just love those hunky lizard men though. Would have been an insecty. Did we establish what an insecty is? Thank you, Arky. Thank you. Ooh. A buggy, right? A but yeah, buggy's pretty cool. Catchy. Captain protests too much about not being a furry. Isn't giving anyone else a hard time? No. No, 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 no. We we, we did have a debate about bees earlier because bees are technically furries, but they're also technically insects. something to think about oh no nude men I'm pretty sure oh no I mean nude yes but not the uh, nude men I expected this is quite good for um grinding right I'm doing this just to level lads nothing else no other reason we go. Not the nude men that I'm desperately hoping to see, no. No, no. Yeah, I'm collecting stars. Right, clothes men. Don't like clothes men. If you've got clothes on, get out of here. This is a nudist colony and I'm here to fucking defend it. Get out of here, clothes man. You. Uh, clothed men do come in with a lot of money on them, which is quite nice. Because they've got the pockets. They've got the pockets to hold the money. Nude men don't have, like, they've got one pocket and it doesn't fit many coins up it. In it. Got proper pockets. Right, we're going to wait for our mana. I expect. Those. Camp for just camp for an hour. Just an hour. Lovely. You wake up. Lovely. That worked out. Every full health. Um. Ninety six. Right. We want to. What we want to do is we want to circle around to here, and then from here we can go straight up into where we need to be. I think. 
we need to go down here. Yeah, into here. And from there. The Jimmy Chan. So we are wanting to go through these doors. How's Todd How Flopper doing? He's doing all right. He's got some good. Um, he's got some good loot. He's been a little bit unlucky. Let's be honest. He hasn't sold quite as many copies of Skyrim as he thought he would have. He's very upset to see the chat. Uh, most people do not own Skyrim, but hopefully it's made up by the fact that people do own who do own Skyrim own multiple copies of Skyrim. Is it this way that I want to go? You know, you'd think that they these guys would be a little bit more happy that I defended their nudist colonies from... Oh my god, I defeated them! You'd think they'd be a little bit more grateful that I defended them against the clothed men, right? Got 35 gold pieces! And a bracelet! Ooh-wee! A lot of money. That's a good victory. We'll save as well. I like the green. What color is that? Is this uh, is this Skyrim green? I feel like that's what you call it. Ah, oh, they wear underwear. They're not too true nudists. Oh, they're very good. Oh, lizard green. That's what we'll call the thing. They're fucking fake nudists. Scared hairless, thank you very much for the follow, thank you. What if it's just their grundle fur? Yeah, it's true, we shouldn't be so judgmental, should we? Is this this door? Oh, gobbo, gobbo, gobbo! Don't know where the gobbo did, he just disappeared from reality. Not that door. Next door. I hear some more gobbos. I like gobbos because they're weak. I'm not even going to bother looting them. Uh, straight up. Not even worth my time. This is not where I expect it to be, I don't think. Hey, Alakazam! It's it is it's um. How is this game? Um. Well, it's certainly it's different. Yeah, yeah, it's diff it's different. Um. It's different. <laughs> Is that a good answer? Hmm. It's like, uh, you know, when someone says, how's my hair? And it's, you know. It's different. It's different. Um, it's not too difficult to go back to. It's not, it's not really that bad. Um, it's a little bit tricky. I think I went the wrong way. It's getting easier with every level. Yeah. Yeah, all right. Yeah, I'll say that. You're right there. We want to go in this room. Go through here. I've gotten all turned a bloody round now. On a scale of crock to thief. I don't understand which one's meant to be the worst one out of the two. Through this door. There's a stone keep game? Is that anything to do with Elder Scrolls? It must be. <gasps> Ooh. Yeah, we we fucked up a little bit. Um I say we because it diffuses the blame from me. 
um, that we were, if, if we'd just gone right when we'd entered the keep, we would have very quickly found what we were looking for. However, we went left and now we've been in here for maybe four hours or so. So that's kind of, that's how it's kind of going, you know. Right, we found where we're meant to be going. But what, Nick Cage? Like Nicholas Cage. Stealer of Declaration of Independence, Nick Cage. We are following the goblin con tun the goblin tunnels till we make our last stand, I think that said. There we go. Is this where I'm meant to be? Over there? I think we we take to the water. And we're looking for the middle. Oh, it was a Nokia gaming phone. I thought that's what we were calling Nicholas Cage now. Uh, we didn't go forwards. We went this way. You know, forwards is a difficult, <laughs> difficult direction. Back away. With you died our last hope for justice. Tharn is now free to do as he wills. It saddens me to see the beautiful land of Tamriel rotting from within. Goodbye. I wish you peace in the afterworld. I just wanted to write ghouls ahead. Too late. I suppose, you know, more naked men to finish off our, uh, because we we are very close. We we saved very recently, don't we? We are approaching the end of this dungeon. I died. I died, and the last hope of fucking justice died with me. We subscribe to the Bark Box that sends us a box full of themed toys and treats every month. The dog toys, right? <laughs> just, <laughs> just to confirm. Presumably, it's called Bark Box. Just to get funny. What's 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 movies got in it? Is it a uh, plushie of Nicolas Cage? I can see some gentlemen over there. Oh no, they are naked men. Right, so let's just get close enough to the naked men. One of the toys is a bucket of popcorn where the bucket crackles and crinkles. Oh, that's cool, and the popcorn can come out and it squeaks. That sounds really irritating as well. <laughs> That sounds like a noisy toy. Wow. <laughs> I accidentally put it back in and can't figure out how to get it back out. Yeah. Sue likes new toys and then she doesn't... She So she likes her old toys. But she has a distinct preference for collecting new ones. And then she's less interested in them after she's had them for a bit. The kind of toy you give to other people's dogs. Like the slime gun. The slime, um, so it's a slime shooter. Like a slime shooter gun. Like a water gun, but it shoots slime instead of water. Um, so I am going to be getting it for my sister's child. Yeah, less interested once we have the toy for a bit. She's very excited about that new one, so. Yeah, like anime figures, right? On the shelf you go. <laughs> I personally love my anime figures even after I've had them for a while. Yeah. 
I know some people do fall out of love with them. I should say if you're right. I'm just going to say, save us Todd Dabs. I want to kill him, otherwise he'll like sneak up behind me. The wheel was our favorite toy. Yeah, like the snot shooters, exactly. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. I thought it would go down a treat. They're not that expensive either. I was very pleased. Not only, not only is it a great saving, but it's also a great irritant. It's good value. <laughs> Good value for a lot of fun. Oh, dead man. He got 77 fucking gold pieces on him though. He's not nude. With you died our last hope for justice. <sighs> Giving someone a trombone. I gave my sister's kids a recorder. I don't know how much they enjoyed that. I don't know. Killed by a nudist, I don't know. Maybe. Maybe they're not nude. Maybe these are their suits. There we go. I can hear another one. Body pain. Ay, ay, ay. Are these uh, are these ghouls in later Elder Scrolls games? Hard game is hard. Lure him into a position where you can cheese him. Yeah. Very cheesy if he hits me. Is there any way I can like jump? Can I jump up there? I think I can cheese it, lads. I think, I think we're cheesing it. I think we got a whole fucking pocket full of Cheez-Its. And we gotta rub them all over Todd's body. We'll try and cheese it that way. Is this really how I'm supposed to do this? Todd, we need to talk. Brooks, I hope you have a nice lunch. I hope it's nothing that gives you diarrhea. 
Yeah. Oh, it's been so easy. I'm not saving after I kill that ghoul. I'm not. I don't want to save. Get up there, Todd. Up you go. What the fuck hit me? Who is hitting me? What hit me? Who hit me? What we hit me? Our last hope for justice. Tharn is now free fuck you, Fujibad. Fuck you. You deal with this. <laughs> I saw that rain, man. I looked at the time and I was like, yes. Fuck you, Fujibad. You deal with this tomorrow. Also, we'll be back, lads. With more Elder Scrolls Arena tomorrow. Hey, Badger. So it's all right. It's okay. So we know where we're supposed to go. We just have a couple of naked men that we have to kill before we can. And then we're done. Literally done. All that's standing between us and the end of the dungeon, two naked men. Two naked men. We can do that. Easy. Right? They're not even wearing any clothes. Future Badge will never get the respect she deserves. <laughs> yeah, fuck it. Deal with that tomorrow. Yeah, so we will be we'll be back with Elder Scrolls Arena tomorrow at 1 p.m. GMT. BST. Because we're on summertime now. GMT tomorrow. Um Would you like to send a future magic future a message for future badger? <laughs> get wrecked, nerd. <laughs> yeah, get wrecked, nerd. Plus my destiny saw a random arrow headline there? The dogs are trying to get you. The dogs are out to get you. Uh, they're BFFs, are they? How far in the future, Gullix? Depends how far in the future, eh? Right. I will see you lads tomorrow. I'm gonna let you out in the other, because I'm hangry. Hangry, and my hands are cold as well. Um, I will see you, see you tomorrow. Uh, I will also see you on Friday for a game that I haven't decided on. It might be more out of scores, it might be a different game. Well, I'll see. I'll see you. I'll see you then, right here tomorrow, for more of what we did today. Or naked men. <laughs> see you later, lads. Thank you very much for being here for the stream. I'll see you later. You have a good Monday, Wednesday, Friday, Tuesday. It's Tuesday. I'll see. You. It's Tuesday. Have a good Tuesday. Okay. <laughs> okay. Thank you very much. Thank you. Have a fantastic rest of your day.